My hands stable, I feel able to turn the tables. I could do this. Just keep moving, keep your hands up, stupid. I feel lucid, a new viewing. I can see the end, I can see my future, I can view it. It's right there for the taking. Everything I've ever wanted, dreams are just waiting. I just gotta fight for it, willing to die for it, willing to like soreness. I just need to hike for it. I'm standing up cause I've had enough. I won't give up on the chance. As long as I'm breathing, I'm not retreating. I could be bleeding, I'll take a beat and keep on proceeding. I'm not fatiguing, cause once I get to the ring, I'll be undefeated. No sunlight, so cold, sleep is nice, so tired, my eyes fight, they just want to close back up tight, get up, put it on, hard work at the crack of dawn, this life ain't for the weak ones, no, this life pure only for the strong, feeling slow, shake it off, don't got time for negative thoughts, where is sight, got the dot, shoot my shot, I want the top, never lost, got my plot, know my story, I know my boss, I will fight against the clock, time's a limited gift from God. One day I will have my victory Crush all my enemies so viciously Work so hard my hands are blistering And they will carve my name in history Wake up to the sound of the drums Stand up, rock and roll, but here I come I'm here to stay, here to fight another day You can't stop me with some pain I am here to make a change Whoa. Student of the game I study every single frame I don't just listen, man, I change And grow a little every day I got this hunger deep inside of me I got this need that keeps on guiding me 
I got this energy providing me. It's all I need to overcome all my anxiety. One day I will have my victory. Crush all my enemies so viciously. Work so hard, my hands are blistering. And they will carve my name in history. Wake up to the sound of the drums. Stand up, rock and roll, but here I come. I'm here to stay, here to fight another day. You can't stop me with some pain. I am here to make a change. Whoa. Hello, everyone. Hello. Welcome to another Age of Calamities uh, live stream. Um, I see you there. Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, everyone, to another Conan Exiles Age of Calamities. It's a mod um, for uh, Conan Exiles, um, in my opinion. One of the best mods, or maybe the best mods in terms of um, more content, weapons, and armors. So yeah, um, please check it out. If ever you haven't followed or subscribed or liked yet, please do so. That would help us a lot. And also for those who are looking for temporary guides for the changes, since um, changes are still in the works and still being added. And that being said, we actually got a new patch, I think, two days ago. So yeah, there we go. And we're going to be covering um, the, the additions or the changes as much as we can. So here we go. Here we go. Um, let's have a shout out for those who are here. Hello, Ash, as always. Hello, Hello. Valkyrie. Hello, Iceman. So Hello. there we go. Uh, time for deep connection orbs. Why? You guys already found how to attune? Because I haven't. I know what it's for. <laughs> I know what the because tornado is for. And we know we know already how to attune it. We know what the deep connections is for, but so far, I checked Discord as well, no one has actually found yet on how to attune to it. So yes, um, we will cover how it's being used and what it's for. Um, we will talk about that, and then maybe if Espen will be kind enough, because I never ask Espen as well, and I think Espen is just uh, waiting for me to ask, but I want, I want it to be discovered. Because um, there has been some location changes and... <laughs> the exploits and the orb, purple orb, a lot of people are mad about it. So you can really tell those who really just want to cut corners and there you go. There you go. Well, my job was just to show it to Espen and it seems like Espen agreed with me that no one should take it easy in terms of getting you know high level tiers but i do agree with some of the feedback that uh, maybe it can still be used for the vanilla ones and maybe can only be used for the high tier ones in um the mods like aoc iwa and, and vam but i don't know if that's possible but we're gonna ask espen if that is possible and some also recommended that there could be like a switch button where the purple orb works and not work. At least the admin of the server would have the choice. If he wants um, proper progression, or he will allow people who don't really have the time to grind to just use the orb. So it's all about, you know, the, the admin's preferences. But then again, the the lead dev, it's going to be his, uh, his call if, you know, he wants you to play with the progression that's actually being placed. I already got to go. Oh, Espen is here. Espen! 
Ben. Hello. <laughs> I already got a good plan for the orbs moving forward. However, right now the Halloween event will. Yes. I really like the sound effect, though. I will try it later. <laughs> I will try it later. <laughs> Valkyrie's here as well. Oh yeah, I saw Valkyrie earlier. Yeah, I like the <laughs> I, I like the sound, Espen. It's so comedic. All right. Okay, so the very first thing that we're gonna do. Oh, by the way, for those who are just watching now, uh, this is the. Hold on, is this the sixth us or the fifth series? Hold on, let me see. I can't remember. I think it's the fifth. Um, uh, yes, it's the fifth. <laughs> So this is the fifth of the series of walkthroughs. It's not a playthrough. It's a walkthrough. So there's a difference. We're just figuring out and um, learning all the new stuff. Since the last update, July, um, another drop just last month, October. And we're um, experiencing some of the changes on, on a weekly basis. Um, as you can see, the patch was just released two days ago. And Espen is here also with us in chat. Uh, he is uh, the, the, the leading dev of um, Age of Calamity. So we're getting firsthand um, feedback. At the same time, we're giving feedback and questions back and forth. So at least we're uh, learning the game at the same time. Um, he's able to check what's working and what's not so that they can also have a good idea on what they want to do on the next patch. Especially... Um, the, the the mod is not yet uh, finished in some way. Um, after the chapter two of Age of War. So yep, 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 yep. So I'm glad everyone's here. Um, when I say everyone, the usual people who are in chat, thank you so much for being here. Uh, check the description below if you are watching this as a replay because there will be timestamps. The same as the other videos uh, previously. Also timestamp. So that you guys can just click on them if you want to search for a specific topic or a walkthrough. Okay. Now. Let me grab the patch notes. There we go. Okay. Uh, we're not going to cover everything and everything in the patch notes. Uh, some of them we are going to, let's say... Just experience it later on, but I want to focus on the highlights, especially the ones that, um, let's say, we ask questions about and recommended or given feedback about during our previous stream. So let's check the patch notes. Let me just show my browser. Browser on. There you go. I don't think we have uh, bad bookmarks. No, no bad bookmarks. Good, good. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. <laughs> I don't want to expose myself, you know? I have a I have a private life as well. Okay. Version 4.02, uh changes and fixes. So improved mod compatibility. Okay. Um that's good. At least um we will be experiencing less to no um, conflict in terms of other mods um, compatibility or also the base game compatibility. So whatever is behind that, the coding behind that, I trust that um, Espen and the team um, made sure that... Oh, no! Oh, this is... Okay, that's base game, though. It's freakity freak. Well, if it has no fatal error, it's not fun, calm. Always remember that. Uh -oh. If the game is working well, then you should wonder, is Funcom still, you know, developing the game? What? <laughs> that's, that's what you need to worry about. Okay, RIP, I know, right? Okay, while well, it's launching, uh, we're, gonna, we're gonna read the other um, patch notes. Uh, tag IDs for AOC bows. Uh, I'm not sure about that. AOC seeds, I'm not really interested in planting. Maybe Oz can... Touch base on that later on. And there we go. Updated purple lotus herb. Or um herbs. Herb. Purple <laughs> lotus orb. There we go. We're gonna test that later. Um, it doesn't work anymore. Clap clap. So for those who want to cut corners, maybe until S Pen, you know, gives us an option, then 
You better, you know, you better get those truncheons. For better, you know, for better taming. Um, okay. Let me just go back. First, okay, let's uh, let Conan do his intro first. Your riches. They took your family then and your they riches. Took your health and your pride. Finally. Purple Lotus Orb change and not having it move to server owner option is a horrible move. And I stand by this. Um, I agree with I agree with um not giving giving the uh, server owner an option. But you know you know what I you know what I know? Espen can remove the uh, the purple lotus orb and I don't give a fuck. I will be happy with it. And I stand by that as well. And I can give you a very good example. Having the purple uh, ha having the purple lotus orb it disrespected the time and effort and the creativity that the devs have made with the progression the the progression of uh, Iceman of course you agree with Rook and Cade Iceman I know you like to cut corners so yeah I, of course I understand I know you're standing on that already um, and I, I believe you understand my my you know my main um, reason as well it is a disrespect you know why Progression of every material, different minerals of every material, the grinding of every material, the grinding of Iverian or whatever until you, you reach Chronixium. You can actually just omit that. Remove all the hard work, sweat, and creativity just because you have a purple orb. And I'm not the type of person who will disrespect playthrough and also disrespect and skipping what the game is intended to actually and how to be played. That's my stand and ever, ever since it's been like that. However, there's a big however, there's a big but with a double T. You may not be a new player anymore. You don't care about progression because you already had. And you can just probably just use a purple orb. Screw it, I already know how to trungeon someone. Screw it, I already know how to bludger someone. Screw it, I already know how to get them. I'm just cutting, you know, I'm just cutting the scene and then I just want to get them. Good. Use the orb. There we go. That's my stand on that. Hello! Thank you so much for the follow! Uh-oh. We're having Destiny double notifications. Good evening! Good evening, Durset. Durset82. Thank you so much for the follow. Seems like we're getting double notification again from... Uh... What the heck? I already turned that off. Ah! Okay, I'm in my browser desktop. That makes sense. Okay. Good evening, good evening, good evening. Have you tried to customize the AOC main menu? <gasps> I will try. Main menu. Customize. We will go there, Espen. God damn it, we were... We, we, we just got hit by a fatal error. We got hit, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, gentlemen. So, yeah. Uh, on that regard, every time I go to Discord and I see the, the complaints... I am so willing to actually read through those. And some of them got really good points. But every time someone would say, I hate it, and then, you know, you know how life works. You say you hate it, and then you don't even qualify why. Like, that's what you call bias. And bias is... I'm, I'm just gonna say it's unethical and it's shameless. Uh, I understand though it's a joke for an event. No, uh, even First, though it will extend over an they event. Took your family and your riches. It is a disrespect to the developers then of the game. Um, I believe. I don't know if. Hold on. I, I really like this because we have a very good thing to talk about. But. But. I will ask. Okay, Iceman, this is your second time. 
And I will ask you to not selectively listen again. If I'm not mistaken, you mentioned you're not American or not English speaker, uh, like primarily, primarily, you're Hispanic. So I would, I don't want you to selectively again. This is your second strike, but brother man, you selectively listen to a, a statement that promotes your narrative and you never listen to everything. L look at your second statement. It's a disrespect to to developers of the game as well as to the mod developers. Did you did you did you listen? Did you fucking listen when I said it could be an option to make the orb work to higher level and not the lower level so that the main game or base game still uses the orb? I don't know if you heard that. But I said it earlier. So selective, you know, selective listening, horrible. I don't like that. So listen to the whole thing. Uh, is the ability to move the orb to a higher knowledge possible? Exactly, that's it. At least Rook is getting this. Move the, move the, you know, the, the orb to a higher tier. Like probably it's able to, it's able to still work on T1 to T4 vanilla, but not able to work to the mod. And I even said, I don't know if Espen can do it. And Espen is, has not said anything yet. Like, oh my god. Ah, I will just move on. Everyone probably understood what I said earlier. I hate it when there's selective listening. Selective listening to promote your own narrative is not cool. At all. Because me, I always I always make sure I'm reading your, your questions and comments correctly. So that I have a at least an on-point answer to it. Hold on, why am I having? So I'm just gonna let that slide again. Because we're just starting the, you know, we're just starting the the stream and that shit, you know, pisses me off all the time. Every time. It happens so many times to me. Someone goes into my chat. Selectively listen just to promote their own narrative. So yeah. Um. I'm just gonna uh, I'm just gonna read Rook for now. Um, like I've ascended already. I have my thralls. Exactly. There we go. At least someone is understanding this. At least someone is understanding this. At least. I believe you said it's a disrespect to the developers to have that orb. See? This if someone if someone understood what I said earlier, can you please explain to Iceman what I actually said on what the orb disrespected? I even mentioned Iverian Iverian Trunjan and the until Kernixium. I think he does not know what those are. I'm asking for a Yeah, someone can clarify it for you, Iceman. Sorry, I don't want to repeat that anymore. I made that very clear earlier. I'm also trying to figure out why I'm heavy so that we can proceed. And my weight is 0%. Hold on. Oz? Yeah? Can you check my inventory, admin? Uh, do I have like a hidden item here? Hold on. Give me a sec. I don't know what's happening to... What the hell is this? Or hell, make a unique recipe with Eliza Cole and the... There we go. Well, Rook seems to know what he's talking about. I like this guy. And we are on the same page. At least. Ah! Do I have to remove all of this? Let me remove all of this first. God damn it. What's making me heavy? Oh, by the way, I uh, I just... I spawned all of these. We did not really farm these. We, were, we got this during our... Uh, so, uh, secret spells episode. <laughs> Hold on. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go with the menu first with S Ben. Um, 48. So I think this is my armor only and whatever I'm bringing. Okay. Uh, shit. I have to, I have to choose what I have to bring here. AOC yep, yep. features main menu. 
Okay, this is the main menu. Espen, what's what changed here? I think there's a customized button. There's a customized button. Where? Hold on. You're Come you're on. the one who navigated this more than me. I actually set mine already. I like Natalie, so I play. Oh, Is shit. it Natalie? Can you please teach me that what? I can move on? It's in ah, the, the main menu for the game where you log in. Okay. Ah, this one. Hold on. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, it's been here before, but it and never listened to us. I set my like the music back. Okay, hold on. Mine will be the harbinger. Then the harbinger. There's no harbinger. No, like the song. I mean, like the music for the background. Look, 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 look. Check it out. Uh, I look back and you said having the purple orb is a disrespect. The time, effort, and creativity, correct. With the progression, correct. That is what I meant. And it's not the devs vanilla, it's the devs of the mods. You know, the progression of the progression of the resources. You start with, after you end up with obsidian. I think obsidian is the highest in vanilla, I'm not sure anymore. You start with Iverian, we, you start with Crescent. And then you progress to um, whatever next, and the highest is Kernixium. You have to progress getting those metals, crafting the truncheon out of those metals, because the higher, the higher the tier, T67, T89, they require a more powerful truncheon that can only be done easily and efficiently if you have higher tier material truncheons. Having the purple orb, eliminates you from grinding crescent to kernixium just because you can stand there and throw you know what i mean so who are you disrespecting that time when you have an orb without even any aggression when thrown and you're facing a t9 and a t9 should be you know it's easy people would say it's possible to get them with a you know a set truncheon uh probably it is but it will take you like 48 you know 48 years but the the game is intended to be played like you have to have at least this type of truncheon to make it easy for you on your throw so like the progression was placed there for you to follow and yet there's one item that could destroy everything destroy the you know destroy the the progression so is it a disrespect to the mods I, in my opinion, I would say yes, because that item, even though using their mods, makes you skip all the necessary things that you're intended to play, just because you have this certain item. Exactly, the dev of the mods. How about the dev of the base game? You're done playing the base game. Iceman! Iceman! I will ignore you after this if you will not still understand because if you if you are not able to understand English that well it's not it's not going to work and it's going to cause frustration for those who are listening as well. I already mentioned it. I already mentioned it. I already mentioned it. <laughs> T1 to T4 probably could could use the orb probably I'm even recommending to Espen. Oh my god, I am... I don't know how to make this easier for this guy. Am I missing this? Am I missing some... Am I missing something with the explanation here? Ugh. And that's why I even mentioned maybe Espen can put an off and on. Or maybe S Pen can restrict it only from T6 to T9. Okay, I, I'm, I'm already in circles. I'm already in circles. So yeah. He <laughs> just let it go. I'm, I'm gonna let it go. I'm already in circles. It's uh, it's irritating. Sorry, Ice Man. I have to be honest with you, and I'm always honest to my chatters. It's it's irritating to be in circles. And we have a good thing going on here. I have to check those. This is not what I'm here for. If you want. If you want your game to, to have like that, go go ahead. Remove AOC since AOC is causing it, and then just play. Respect the devs of the base game. Uh, that will, you know, that will be good. 
And trust me, I, I believe Espen has a lot to say, which are good points. And he's just listening to us right now. Because if Espen did not agree with this in the first place... If Espen did not agree on this in the first place, Espen, would you have done this? You can already tell that. He already did something. So it means I'm not, you know, speaking in his behalf. But I think there is a certain level of agreement that Espen did not want that orb to to be used for high level uh, thralls. Frustrating son of a biscuit. Eye of the Storm? Where is this from? Forsaken Legion. You're using Harbinger of Souls? Yeah. My favorite music factor. <laughs> hey, I've, this is the first time I've seen this. Look, look, us. Look at my stream. What? Look. Is this a vanilla wallpaper? Uh, I think that's Sipta. Is it Sipta? I don't know. Oh, Sipta! Look! The tower is obvious. Yeah, um, and the, are you planning? And the are you planning to add more wallpapers, um, Espan? I'm so sorry, Espan. Espan is just listening. <laughs> like, shit, here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I, actually, a lot of my viewers would always say, shit, here we go. Please, no, no selective understanding. Please, no. Like, Let's be fair. Let's not be biased. We we all love the game. Let's help the game. Okay? I, I believe I believe all your arguments now are from a good place. You love the game. You and I both. All of us watching right now, we love the game. I just want us to be very critical about it and not just say something because we favor one thing. So yeah. Let's make sure that everything we're gonna do, we're gonna say we discuss it properly. No bias, so that at least we can help the game. I can add more down the road. E I, I think more... Uh, okay, let me see. Um, Something where... Cold Embrace okay. is from something, maybe, from the background. Because this one is... Well, this is uh, Anarius. Anarius, you're the... You're the one who read the book, Us. And are are the bosses of the Cold Embrace, or are they Cold I, Embrace? Um, I have to finish reading the uh, book. What the I'll hell? stay with this one. This one is good. And then it's Harbinger of Souls. Okay. There we go. I like that. I like this better. I would love to see more white old paper. I know. Oh, Val, Val is so into like aesthetics and builds. So, yeah, having a different wallpaper will be really great. Actually, Oz has been asking me to check that out. And, like, I was just... You ignored me. Ah, I don't want to check it out. <laughs> and then now Espen is actually the one asking me. Ah, great marigold. Okay, that was fast. Okay, I will bring my ammos. It's uh, essential. Ammos and weapons. Hold on. So today, our agenda will be um, the patch notes. Uh, we got we got stuck on that orb, and I was already expecting that. Because <laughs> I know you guys have, especially for those who really just want to throw orbs... I know you want, you know, the the easy way for, for some reason, but it's already there. And it's a very good reason why that patch is already there. Um, second thing, we are going to test the, the magic orbs after the patch. So if Espen just brought them back without changing their buffs then my my cheat sheet would still be accurate. But if Espen made some tweaks on the buffs, then my cheat sheet is no longer accurate. Espen, can you tell me if you just brought them back without tweaking or did you tweak the the magic orbs? Hmm. Okay, good. At least uh, Espen has a 
The magic orbs have been tweaked. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so my cheat sheet is no longer um, accurate. I have to test them. Uh, the thing is, though, as as a mod, we have to continuously adapt to the base game changes. The purple lotus orb is currently allowing you to bypass majority of the AOC camps. Let's pause there for a while. No skill, no nothing. It makes all the content pointless. The orb applies normal concussive damage, which means we might not be able to bypass um, bypass it for AOC thralls either. If the orb applies one point of damage, it will at least make them hostile. Correct. Actually, making them hostile is already enough for me. Which means, as a normal stun tool, at that point. So there we go. Now you understand why Espen agreed with that. So I told you they they made uh made a lot of effort creativity as I mentioned as well to make a playable content after vanilla. <laughs> and we should we should play that. We should play it as it's intended. You know, that's my opinion and that opinion seems like to be the same as Espen. So if you have a different one then I think we can just agree to disagree. And hopefully there is a way to have a switch some <laughs> some <day. laughs> yeah hold on uh weapons i will check the purple orb because i find it funny um what else should i bring ah, i can just ask my goddess to you know spawn it for me if i need one here we go All right, um, let's go back to our, where the heck is my, where was it? What? My patch notes. Ah, oh, man. Okay, we got sidetracked. Sorry, everyone. Here, here, here. I got it, got it, got it. <laughs> okay, uh, Purple Lotus Orb, and then uh, updated the loot for various AOC NPCs. I think we're talking about drops, uh, basic magic spell do not stagger due to changes of hyper armor i think this is because of the vanilla change certificate of exotic animals certificate of exotic animals isn't that in the the jungle i think certificate of exotic animals yeah if it's if it's not in the jungle it's the npc in the stormhold camp ah a name city so yeah it's one of them right yeah, um, specialty farming. I'm not sure what that is, but if us will have, um, what do you call this? If us will have a, like, the passion. <laughs> so, yeah, maybe. Magic shrine code and animation. Okay. I think, uh, like, the animation when you interact with them. Um, updated trigger pad to leave the final boss. This is, this one I, I really like. So before, if you go to the underworld and you realize that your ass is being kicked by um, Harbinger, the real Harbinger, um, you can already escape using a jump pad. And I believe the safest way is jump pad and then use your air magic, I think, so that you will not, um, you know, you will not die. Let's make it bigger for those who are using mobile. Hold on, there we go. Um, updated various map marker locations. Um, fixed animation glitch for Van Gogh grunts. Oh, I didn't actually experience any glitch yet. Well, we didn't really fight a lot of Van Gogh grunts yet. So let's see. Fixed various exploits. I already found some. And um, I think, yes, we will try that later. Because these exploit areas were really kind of cheesy. Fix an issue with Tome of the Fire Element. 
I did not actually experience this, but good that it seems that some reports were addressed. There were some issues with the Tomb of Air Element, Water, and Fire. I don't know what they were, but they have been fixed. Van Gogh Compost Box. I think this has something to do with planting. Um, need certificate and specialty farming to buy specific items. From vendors. Can't wait for your new underwater cavern video. Yeah, why? What significant changed in there aside from Bobby? And I think it's just Bobby and the location of the water tome. I will definitely make a new one, but is there something new after the patch? Uh fix the merchant item description for Tempest Rain. Tempest Rain. Merchant item description. I'm not sure about this. I haven't seen that. A need certificate and specialty farming to buy specific items from the vendors. Oh, that's why there were a lot of people who were complaining. Like they went to the merchant right away in, in the arcane hall, not arcane hall, sorry, in the faction hall. And then um, it's grayed out or not grayed out. They're not there. Like it's blank. Okay. I will see it in the patch notes. Uh, I think this is what Oz mentioned. So Oz probably already saw that. Um. Hold on. Fix an issue with the ancient arts request. Oh, this is like the tutorial part. Fix an issue with various AOC NPCs didn't uh, drop loot. Okay, I didn't even know that was happening. Fixed and enabled AOC final credits. Fixed an issue with the music playing twice at the final battle. Well, we will be able to test that later once we have already killed all the raid bosses. Fixed various bugs. Thank you, Aspen and the team. There we go. Admin features, added location teleport, new category. Okay, so this is the drop down teleport. New category for POI areas. Points of interest added in AOC admin panel. I think there should be a lot. Oz, can you check if there are new teleport, you know, teleportable locations? Yeah. Tornado mastery. I already know where to master or interact rather. I know what the what the green ones are for. The white ones, yeah, you can just ride them like a cowboy. But the green ones, they have their purpose. We're going to check that out later. Um, deep connection, as I mentioned earlier, I know what it's for. But I don't know how to master it or learn it. We added, uh, they added sickle, starter sickle before iron. Okay, I think there, this was... Remember us when you were playing before, you have a sickle already? The sickle that looks like a ghostly sickle? The specter uh, sickle? What was your um, that was for, faction that time? Um, Belgar? Yeah, it's Belgar. I think it's Belgar uh, okay. or Elvanor. But now I think this is for everyone. Added sickle, yeah. starter sickle before iron. Magic tornado. Um... One thing I can tell you, Tornado is not a castable magic. It's a utility oh, oh, magic. Oh. I think it's Elvin, ma'am. Elvin? I think it's okay. under Elvin, yeah. Added deep connection orbs. So there are orbs in the area, and that orb will... I will tell you later on um, what it's for. Us found them... Um, I think there there is one near the, the faction hall in the cave of Ikaratosh. Updated... Water magic one to five. So the passive ability, um, aside from not able to, um, not able to. Sorry, aside from water breathing, um, it has a new passive now, and I will show you that later. For Earth, um, they added a passive already, but for the love of me, I couldn't figure it out. So we're still figuring out what the passive for Earth is. We had some we had some theories, but when we tested them, they're not the passive for Earth. Um, updated magic types and various back and improvements and new prerequisites. I think we're talking about levels in this case. Um, I'm not sure. Updated frozen depth spell location. Frozen depth is supposedly with what do you call that guy? Burgle? And um, Espen transferred it to somewhere more easy. <laughs> Screw you, Espen. Why did you put it there? 
<laughs> Arcane Dome. Arcane Dome, a.k.a. Um, Ward. There we go. He's laughing us. When I told when I told him why did he transfer it there? How dare you transfer it in there? <laughs> okay. Um, I'm not sure. Oh, S fan, I know what you did here. You sneaky son of a gun. I think he was thinking like, "Oops, this is too big. This is too big. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna make you spend more there." Updated black hole. I hate you with this also, as fan. I think you nerfed this. I haven't tried it much yet, but I think you nerfed the damage. <laughs> this is our weapon, S Pen. How dare you? Oh, you're welcome. He said you're welcome. Okay. <laughs> How can you be mad at that? Uh Divine Magic. This I this I agree. Whoever whoever is moping, whoever is moping about the overhauling of Divine Magic. Um, I, I, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be straight and blunt here. You are a poser, and you are a noob. That's the only thing I can say. Why? Because divine magic was like this before. They did not make any changes here. They just brought it back. Divine magic before was not painful against the living. Divine magic before was specifically. Um, was specifically used to hurt undead, and suddenly I'm not sure which patch that was. And even I think even Laney jumped into okay. um one of my tutorial videos. I think or I think it's a guide video. It was not a live stream. And Laney asked me why I considered it broken. The reason why, and I still remember this. I told Laney that the reason why I said um divine magic is broken now is because before. Divine Magic, if you will compare the, the damage that Divine Magic deals to undead versus the living, is different. But now, using Divine Magic, all of them are hurt the same way. And people are just going to use Divine Magic for every creature because it's painful to everything, regardless if, if they're undead or not. And I think Laney did not respond anymore, and I think that was the time that they were starting to balance um, divine magic again and it's now more painful to undead than you know overall living creatures this is you know this is not new they just brought it back and i think it's just right the divine magic is from the term itself right um at least you will be encouraged to use blood magic arcane and fire if ever you want more damage to living um creatures Magic weapon types will now improve the accuracy of projectiles by ascending. <laughs> yeah, um, I think this is really good. At least when you are ascended from level one, you know, the projectile is not really that um, good to shoot. But the more that you level up, at least it becomes more like if you're playing FPS, this is like an, up uh, an upgraded and modded um, weapon that you're already bringing. Rebalance magic types, damage outputs. Okay, so we will be testing this before we jump into um before we jump into the dungeons. We will check which magic type hurts more in what type of target. Um merchant, so added uh Zephyrus horse to shepherd. This person is always like the most coveted person in the world of AOC. You go to Discord channel and you go like, where is Shepherd? You type you search the the question where is shepherd it's gazillions of questions <laughs> where is shepherd uh, yeah shepherd is out there just find him he's usually bought he's not he's not some some someone you find i think he will be bought if 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 it's still the same as before undead horse sanguis saddle shepherd still imperial saddles um shepherd still Noble saddle. Okay. I think there is a drop in vanilla game. Uh like a saddle. What up? Uh Jaeger? Jaeger? Hello, yo yo yo, what's up? Added underworld gargoyle. <laughs> Oz, what's your comment on the gargoyle? Hello? A gargoyle. <laughs> no, did you try to fight it? No, I did not. <laughs> Added warrior of the Forsaken Vanguard. Um, Forsaken Vanguard. This should be a place where Vangals are. I hope... 
So it's either Nikada or um Gathen area. But there is a new NPC. A mini boss, I think. Warrior of the Forsaken Vanguard. We are going to probably meet this guy later when we do our um dungeon runs. Um added... Lisa always freaks me out. Is it Lisa or ICU? <laughs> oh, we call her the ICU girl. <laughs> she always freaks me out. Pretty nice pronunciation. Jaeger? Jaeger. I believe that's uh, from Attack of Titans. But I don't think that that's the spelling. But I don't know how else I can pronounce it. Sorry if I mispronounce it. But it's a nice pronunciation. Thank you. <laughs> Servers can now limit the player to only one magic type. I like this. I like this. I like this. You so like at, at least as a server owner. Correct? Thank you. <laughs> I just wait. I just winged it. <laughs> um, for those who own servers, at least you can delegate. You know, hey you, you look like more of a fire guy, so you go fire magic <laughs> like that. <laughs> so you can you can just make them learn one magic at a time. There we go. Visuals, okay. S pen. I will tell you how we figured out where to learn let's say tornado or something so i just realized and for those who are also watching this is your hint as well i think espen wouldn't mind because i don't know exactly where they are at the same time um the visual changes also indicates that he added something in there espen and the team they added something in there so for example aloran outskirts of aloran aside from Aside from the deep connection orbs, aside from the tornado, um, those are the things that I have seen added in there. Also, the dragon, um, the black dragon. Holy shit, that black dragon, um, Espen, is not actually a decoration. Like, holy crap on a cracker. Um, it, I don't think it is a decoration. Yeah, it nope. is not a decoration. Trust me, it is not. When I was riding, when I was riding the tornado... It did not like it. <laughs> and I was like underneath it. And for some reason, I think it tried to. <laughs> but I was on God mode. So, yeah. Um, ugh, Underwater cavern. <laughs> Honey, why are you so hateful about underwater cavern? Okay. So, underwater cavern also probably has been added or tweaked because it's here. Updated Goreclaw Deep. Now, this is the reason why we found the what you call that us uh the tornado yeah. mastery what what what, what, what? i'm sorry Gore Claudie. the reason why i went or us went to Gore Claudie because i told her is because i said like visuals it says Gore Claudie. you need to check the Gore Claudie. and then she saw she saw the green tornado in Gore Claudie and then got near it and there's like a, a something there that you can interact and that's where you can learn the mastery of tornado and um, I will do that later. I didn't do it yet. I will do that later. And then I will ride the green tornado so that um, I will be able to know. Uh, you will be able to know. You can see what it you know, actually does. A crystal, correct. Um, sea monster. Um, the sea monster, a.k.a. Mosasaurus. I keep on saying the Saurus thing is I have to search the actual name. Mosasaurus. It's like a whale that had a baby with a crocodile. It's like a prehistoric type of um, sea monster. That's the sea monster in there. It looks like it though. And for some reason, it's um, included in the update for the visuals. So I'm going to check later on what kind of um, visual. Maybe they make it bigger, smaller. Devil Bear Mountain. I already know. <laughs> I already know what you did there, Espen, because I went there because of this visual. What did they change? And then there, you transferred it in there. Without having second thoughts, you transferred that thing in there in the Devil Bear Mountain. Thank you. <laughs> and now no one no one would ever learn that thing just for fun. <sighs> the Tome of Ikaratosh. Yes. <laughs> I know what you added in there also, Espen. So the last the last time we played the Tome of Ikaratosh, I think it was still a baby, and Espen was just waiting for it to grow and bite asses. I think that's what he did. <laughs> in the underworld. So we know already Gargoyle is added. Um, jump pad is added. 
And I think Espen also probably hid something in there. Not sure. We will know. Um, quests. Updated early faction quest gathering amounts. Okay. Um, I'm not sure if it was increased or decreased, but this is during um, the faction quest gathering, um, like probably from 1 to level 11. So yeah. I like it even got more jumping puzzles. <laughs> I know, right? Okay, so we're going to cover some of the highlights as we go around. And yeah, we'll discover it together. Hold on, chat. Let me just go back to the game. There we go. And then I'm going to go bathroom real quick. And yeah. Here we go. Here we go. So many bears. Volner, no. Gorkla, no. And we're back. What's love? Hello, Ponzik. How are you doing? How are you doing? All right. Okay. So where were we? We're going to test the orb. So what I'm going to do. I will not rely on my cheat sheet anymore because uh, they're no longer. They're no longer accurate since S Pen already tweaked. The effects of the orbs. Is Tesla still alive? Yes. And kicking. <laughs> Thank you Chilling for the follow, Jaeger. What up? Is it the third Tesla? Uh, it's the second Tesla. So it's still uh, it's still Tesla Jr. Is it Tesla Jr. or the third? Hold on, let me see. Um, where's my bed? I need to put a bed down. I need to make your, sure. Just in case your I... Your bed is in your bedroom, man. No, no, no. Like, bedroll. Oh. At least if I die, I'm just here in the yard. Did you already test some of the orbs, Oz? Uh, just clicking. <laughs> but okay. I haven't really took note. Okay, so for those who did not know about the oh. uh, the magic orbs, I also had, it's already outdated because they tweaked the effects. I also had a video showcasing their, um, their unique passives or buffs if you interact with them. Um, however, <clears throat> the last time I did the, the attunement, um, I somehow still died. So the the way it works before, and maybe Espen can can confirm or tell us at least on how 
the percentage or percentages actually work. Before, for example, you see those colors? You see the rune colors? The rune colors represent the magic that you need to have or have ascended so that you will have a better chance of getting the buff. So for example, if the color is red, that's blood magic. If it's orange or bright yellow, it's um, fire magic. And this one, it's bluish. I think this is water magic. And then the purple is arcane. That's water. That's fire. Um, is this bluish or white? It seems like this is white. So this is air. So you need to master a specific type of magic in order for you to have a better chance of getting the buff. Now, it, the way it works before is that um, the higher your ascension um the you know the better chance you have of not dying from from the attunement so for example um, with the tier 5 magic is 100% that was that was before however the last time i tried and maybe span can confirm to us if this is a bug or something that needs to be fixed or by design i tried touching the others even though i am already um up to the highest ascension and somehow i still died so look all the magic is already on top ascension so for example orb of blood okay so there's no red thingy coming out so that means good orb of blood will give you two hours of um buff on strength there we go. Uh, stats. There. I think we only have one of the orbs now. I think we only have one of the orbs now. One buff at a time. It's been like that before also. So what I'm going to do. I'm going to kill myself. I think I should go remove bracelet. Yeah, remove bracelet. So, this is the only way that I can remove the... Uh, this is the only way that I can remove the buff. Right away. There we go. So, it's gone. There are three stages. No magic equals death. Good. Tier 1 to tier 4 has randomized chance... Of killing debuff still max uh, has 100% okay so I should be able I should be able to attune to them without any problem now because I have maxed my magic all right so orb of blood so I hope you guys are taking notes now orb of blood that's strength so let's go touch everything that has something to do with blood magic so this one is Orb of Plague. If this was still the same as before, this one will give you protection from Ilarican Plague. Not immunity, protection. The same as the rings that I've shown in the previous, you know, stream. All right. This seems to be successful. There we go. Magic protection against Plague. Just one hour. Just one info. The dragon looks yeah. scary. It looks really scary. Now, let's try and attune to a second one and let's see if it stacks because um, it seems like you guys are wondering about that as well. The last time I did, it didn't. It killed me when I wanted more. So let me touch this next one. Okay. We're taking notes. This one is... Strength. This one is protection from the plague. Not immunity. I repeat. Not immunity, just protection. It will allow you to have lesser stacks. And it doesn't linger anymore the moment you got out of the mist. Unlike without any protection, even though you're already out of the mist, there's still going to be a countdown. 10, 9, 8. There's no more like that if ever you have that attunement of plague. But it doesn't mean you can soak yourself in there and expect to live. This is just for, you know, escaping. Best chance to escape. All right, now uh, the orb of death. Now I'm touching this 
with an existing buff. Let's see what happens. We're dead! <laughs> Our head's gonna pop! Uh, that didn't kill me! I just got damaged, but I didn't die. But my... My buff didn't change. Why didn't I die? Well, I'm happy I'm I didn't die. But <laughs> why didn't I die? Okay, I'm, I'm touching it again. You will know if it's a fail because if you see like the, the red thingy coming out. That one. Are you in god mode? Let me see. I don't think I am. Hold on, S Pen. I will I will I will go to admin so that we can check. I think you are. I'm not. I already changed it earlier. Before oh. um restarting. But I will check it again. Okay, let me just go back in game. And I'll go admin. Cheat panel. Oh. Nope, I'm not in god mode. I am a normal human being. Or a normal Conan Exiles uh, character. I think the Plague of Protection is blocking it out. Actually, I can see the... I can see the debuff for how many seconds. Look. Focus your attention on my left side. See? It says too much magic and it suddenly disappears, Espen. It didn't linger. It had like 30 seconds, but it disappeared. So I think that's Espen's, you know, note in there. Let's see what this one gives. I will kill myself right here so that my body will pile up. Right here, right now. Um, where is it? Do you have something that removes the buff pet or something? Um, no, my pet is... Let me just keep my pet. My pet is... Uh, I'm not sure what it gives, but it actually gives nothing or healing. There, it's gone. Let's remove everything that's attached to me. I'm going to touch it again. For science! Yeah. Instead of lingering for 38 seconds, it disappears right away, Espen. Let me try the other magic, though. I will try and touch the uh, water magic. Here we go. Let's see if this one kills me. Oh, it's being blocked, um, Espen, by the existing buff. Okay, let me... Let me change our buff. Let's change this to something else. I will stay with the strength. I will stay with the strength buff and then I will touch the others. There is a possibility that the plague of protection is removing the countdown because that's what it does. However, it does it only to plagues, not to all debuffs. So maybe, yeah, uh, maybe that's the miss there, Espen. Okay, let me try this one. Orbo Blood. Orbo Blood does not block anything. It will just add strength. And then after getting the strength buff, we're gonna touch something else. Alright. <laughs> A lot of people actually think this is like, oh, I'm glitched because your character is frozen. You just have to wait until, you know, she puts down her arms. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna touch the um, Orb of Frost. I think my head is gonna pop this time. It's gonna pop! 100%! There! I'm dead. I'm dead! It's supposed to be like that. There's like a 30 second. So yes, I think the... I think the... Little. The Plague Protection also protected me from the other debuff countdown. 
Dead oh. Yep, it's the protection. Yep. It's supposed to only work against the plague. That's what it does to the plague. At least we have a good example. So instead of the plague saying 38, 37, it doesn't say that anymore. The moment that you got out of the, the, the mist, you know, you're already dead. Oh, you're already um you're already okay. Now some people some people will think, so we are back to orbital plague. Some people would think that it's bugged because hey, I already touched the orbital plague and yet I was still plagued. No 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 no. You still you're still gonna get it. You're still gonna get stacks. It's just the moment you got out, at least the stack goes away immediately. Uh, what up, Gohibas? Uh, this kind of isn't new in a way. Correct, it's not. The uh, the magic orbs, Gohibas, were not also new. They were old. They were just removed in, I think, three patches, four patches, and then they, you know, they put it back. We'll fix it. Thank you, Espen. Oh, thank God Espen is here. At least we're getting, you know, real-time fixes. Okay. That gives you strength. Two hours. This will give you Orb of Plague Protection, not immunity. And then let's try this one. So we're touching all the blood magic related now. Orb of Death, what do you give? I'm talking about not getting wrecked by orbs. Orbs with plague protection in immunity from ring. I'm talking about not getting erect by orbs. I'm... I'm not so sure what you mean. Uh, Gohibas. Please uh, expound. This one bestowed temporary period of time. Ah, corruption! <laughs> Well, you already have your divine magic, but at least if you don't have a divine magic, you can use this. All right, cool, cool, cool. All right, let's die. So we have a buff for strength. We have a protection from plague. We have a protection from um, corruption aside from the divine magic. Now let's see what's more. Uh, Orb of Frost and Mysticism gives agility. We'll see. We'll try. I think those are all water magic related. Let's see. We're gonna cover the blood magic first. Oh, by the way. I forgot about this. I'm sorry. The reason why Oz um, organized it this way and there's a banner. Because these orbs can only be crafted by someone under the Cold Embrace. There. And then now we'll go here. It seems like there's no blood magic here. These orbs can be crafted by Felgarth. And these orbs can be crafted by Elvanor. Okay, so those are all the blood magic. Let's go back. <clears throat> Example, I had a ring against plague and touched the orb to learn lightning magic above Ymir without attunement. Lightning magic. You mean air magic. Okay. I had a ring of plague. You have the ring of Erevosh. Do you have the ring of Erevosh or the ring of immunity? Those two are uh, different in terms of protection. I also showed that in my other video when we were playing with K9. Without attunement and it did not because of the ring. Um, the ring removes the... Well, thank you for telling us that. At least Espen is here. The ring of immunity or the ring of Erevosh, regardless which one you're using, they're not supposed to protect you from power overload. They're supposed to protect you from um, the plague countdown. That's why I said it's not new. Ah, okay. The effects you mean. I got gotcha. you. The Ring of Immunity does not actually... If you're talking about immunity, not the Erevosh, um, I think the Ring of Immunity is... I, it would make sense because that's an admin item. That is an admin item. So there is a possibility that it only does, uh, it doesn't only protect you from plague. That also protects you from um, 
what do you call that from any other debuffs however however there's a big however this one this is specifically only sorry not that one this one this one is only specific to plague protection that is its intended use that's why espen you can see it in the chat since he is in twitch also with you he said he will fix it i'm not I'm, I'm not sure if you're familiar with espen but yeah he will be fixing that and you telling us about the ring of um the ring of protection as well or the ring of immunity that will be fixed as well because those rings are supposed to only protect you from the plague and not from any magic overload so thank you for sharing that all right now let's go with so we are done with um blood magic let's go with um let's see which one let's go with water because it seems like there's a lot of water here orb of frost let's see what it gives now this one um, will only work 100% if you have maxed out your water magic. Now, if you did not learn any water magic at all, I repeat, and don't, you know, don't tell me I didn't warn you. If you don't have any magic um, for, um, for water yet, like you did not even attune yet, if you interact with this, you will absolutely die. If you have ascended um, from 1 to 4 um, in terms of weapon numbers. So in terms of weapon numbers, if you have weapon 1 to 4, it means you have only ascended third time. You will have a 50-50 chance of learning it. However, if your weapon is already magic 5, aka ascension 4 maxed out, then you will have this 100%. If you don't have an existing orb um, buff yet, you cannot double the buff from orbs. It will kill you. That is supposedly the design. So one at a time only. So let's see what Orb of Frost gives. Magic damage increase. Yay! Oh, us. This is your this is your buff right here. Orb of what? Orb of Frost. Magic oh. damage increase. Woohoo! There we go. Orb of Frost from um, our friends from the... Uh, <clears throat> Do I have to like master a magic? Uh, water. Magic you need to that? max out water and you should be okay. good. Okay. All right. <laughs> now let's kill ourselves. Okay, let's kill ourselves oh, here oh, on oh. this side. So that will add plus five agility. Let's check our stats. Hold on, not stats. Um. Oh yeah, stats. The hell. Hmm. Um. It's supposed to show... Ah, yes. It's plus five agility. There we go. My fault. Um, I went to stats, but for some reason, stats will only tell you here. And the breakdown here. But if you go to... If you go to attributes, you will see it from here. So agility is plus five. There, there. That's already a big help. You know why? Here's why. Because... It stacks. I'm a uh, ramping. I'm a uh, cat walking. I mean, doing the the model ramp kind of walk. What? I will show you why this is good. Now, vanilla game will only allow you one food at a time, in one potion at a time, right? So let's do it. Yeah. So now you can already have three buffs. Where's my food? Um, this one. Look, I have three buffs now. 
So, if you have agility food and you also have the agility potion, you can have three buffs for your magic. That's cool. So, it stacks up with food and um, the potion. It does not get overwritten. However, you cannot stack all food. You cannot stack all potion. Um, you cannot also stack all orb buffs. So, one orb, one orb, one food, one potion. So, there we go. So, you can eat food buff, potion, and orb plus 35 total. Um, yep. You just add all the numbers from every, you know, from every um, one potion, every one food, and every orb that you have, then yes. Tattoos don't give buff anymore. I'm not sure. I haven't really touched any vanilla tattoos. But maybe someone in chat can validate that. Alright. So that's Orb of Frost. Let's touch Orb of Love. This is water breathing before. I don't know if it's still the same now. Let's see. Remove bracelet. Ah, my head popped. Did you see that? Yeah. I died. That is gory. <laughs> That's gory. BRB. Hey, can you get me cola? Yeah, I don't know. That's what <laughs> I was about to do. I know. I know what you're about to do. I'm here. <laughs> I know what you're about to do. All right, let's heal ourselves. Not to mention the shoulder pets. Oh yeah, the shoulder pets from XL6 Stream. Um, some of them, or very few of them, actually have stats. So yeah, it can help. All right, let's uh, try another water magic. So orb. What's that? Orb of frost gives us magic power. And orb of love. I remember water breathing, so let's see. It's still water breathing. There we go. So Orb of Love is water breathing. However, uh, you, if you already have um, the water magic equipped, then yeah, that will that will give you water breathing already. All right, the next one. So that's air. I think that's air. Yeah, that's air. Let's go with another water orb. And this is not water. That's already earth. So there are only two? There are only two water orbs. Orb of Frost will give you magic damage. And Orb of Love will give you water breathing. Alright. Now, if you have this already at home and you don't have a water magic weapon... You can just put a bedroll down, put a bedroll right next to it, and then just keep touching it. As long as you have um, at least level 1 magic for water, you have a chance of getting the water breathing for 1 hour. But of course, it's 50-50. Alright, let's pop our head. Now, the next thing we're going to try is the... Uh, The fire magic, because it seems like there are too many. Okay, we have no fire magic here. We have fire magic here. Okay. So for the fire magic, orb of purity. Let's see what it does. So again, for those who are just watching now... I already have full ascensions to all the magic, so that's why I'm getting 100%. Attunement of Purity. <gasps> I forgot to read! Goddamn! Okay, hold on. What was that, chat? Did you catch that? <laughs> ah, here, 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 here. Curse and Poison Protection. There we go. So, if you're fighting anything poisonous, you will not get a stack of um, poison. Is this fire or divine? Hold on. Oh, this is divine. Sorry. Thank you, Gohibas. I don't think there's fire, though. Can you see, like, an orange thingy? Orange. I don't see any orange. Or bright yellow. 
So this is this is divine magic. Thank you for catching that, Gohibes. Yep, this is divine. And divine, um, it cleanses you from any curse or any um uh, poison stacks. All right. So that's orb of purity, and that would last for one hour. Killing myself again. Um, yeah, you should, you should take note of which faction you can actually craft them. That would be, uh, that would be really smart. Alright, let's, uh, transfer our bed somewhere near. <laughs> Oz created a very huge base. Every time I respawn, I, stu uh, I stutter. Okay, so that's Orb of Purity Divine. We'll circle back back to uh, the Air and Arcane later. So let's go Divine for now. Melee damage has been increased. Woo! Orb of Fate is melee damage increased. So that should probably be under Strength. Let's see. It doesn't show a strength, so probably just damage. Question is, by how much? Melee. Hmm. Carry weight, defense, followers, damage. I think can only do this if we have like uh, a sample enemy or thrall that we can hit with the same weapon and we can check the damage. Okay. I can't reach us. Thank you. Um, Hold on. Let me just check this. Uh, we're not seeing any plus something. <clears throat> so we have, hold on. Um, it's 80. Whoa! Whoa. Hold on, how much was the raw damage? The raw damage is 80. Okay, the raw damage is 80. Uh, I don't know how you're gonna calculate this, but... Weapon damage is 80. The weapon is 80. And then this one is supposedly going to add melee damage. Are we going to look at the total damage? While you guys do the math, because that will take some time. And also some... I think you need to consider the total damage, not only the weapon. and Because it pretty much increases your um, weapon damage supposedly for melee. And this is definitely melee. However, uh, there has been a huge increase in the total damage. So you you guys do the math. You have, um, you have the information anyway, on what to click. So just do me a favor so that we can proceed. And these numbers may change in the future, since then again, remember, this mod is still being you know continuously developed and tweaked. So until they're done with you know playing catch up with um, the Age of War then we cannot really tell if those numbers are already it or not. Alright, so that's melee damage. Oz is skinning me. She is skinning my corpses. Yeah, but that's meat, ma'am. Just getting my meat. So yeah, now we I can have, make burgers. <laughs> I have very good meat. Let's make that into burgers. Yeah, correct. 
What the hell? Show stats again after death. Let's see. Yeah, the weapon is still 80, but look at the total damage. The total damage earlier was 500. Now it's 100, uh, 176. So yeah, just do the math there. I think it's 500 plus. So that's a lot of damage added. Orb of Faith. That's a big difference, I know. So that's melee damage. So if you want, if you want melee, go ahead. Orb of Clarity. This is also from Divine Magic, I think. They have a different color though. Let me see. Or maybe just the light. Yeah, that's still divine. Touching it. Oh, encumbrance. This is what I need. <laughs> this is what I need, chat. <sighs> what? Rigor, rigor mort is okay. There we go. <laughs> Encumbrance, let's go attributes. Uh, that's plus five on expertise. Okay, good. Oh my god, I cannot harvest them yet. <laughs> All right, now let's go to arcane. All right, arcane is there. There are two arcanes. So let's do it. All right, I hope you're having fun with my meat, Oz. Uh, I'm skinning them now. I don't need your meat anymore. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I need to make chicharron. <laughs> chicharron. Oh, Valkyrie understand what chicharron is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go with arcane magic, guys. Orb of vision, what does it give? Authority has increased. Oh, plus five, I believe. Plus five on authority. God damn. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. All right. 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 Orb of vision. Another arcane. We have it there. Let's kill ourselves. She made enough <laughs> meat burgers, I guess. No, not enough. There will never be enough. <laughs> we there will always be more, more, more. <laughs> oh, it's crazy. All right. Okay. Go. Orb of mysticism. This is the second and the last one for arcane magic. I want lasagna. <laughs> lasagna, please. Honey. <laughs> please. Agility. Oh, there we go. Agility. For those who are, you know, magic thingy. So there are two. I believe Jaeger, um, Jaeger mentioned this earlier. Orb of Mysticism and the other one, Orb of Frost. They give you um, agility plus five. There we go. All right, so they're just the same. The other one will just say magic damage, and the other one will say agility, which is um, actually the same. But in terms of damage breakdown, maybe it's different. So I trust you guys can make experiments um, which one is which. All right, so now we only have two left. We have air magic, and we have the earth magic. Okay, two more deaths. <laughs> Stop <-ing. laughs> By the way guys, since you know Halloween was just yesterday, um we actually have a a a myth in our country. Um it looks like it looks like um the death that I just had earlier. So that that monster um actually splits I think it's only women who can actually do it. Um, she will split herself in half, like horizontally. So her lower body will be left. She will hide it somewhere. And her upper body will fly with, you know, wings of the gargoyle. And then they like to eat babies. So they target pretty much um, pregnant women or women who are about to, you know, have labor. 
We call it manananggal. I think other countries would call it gargoyle. However, imagine a gargoyle without lower, you know, the lower half. That's that's it. All right, orb of intellect. Yeah, man. Random math is 400 flat seems because the only increased bonus from items 40 to 40 or 40 to 440. Woo! That's a lot. That's good. That one, right? Oh, I'm so tempted with this one. Orb of faith. Okay, orb of intellect from air magic. That's very cozy. I don't think it is. Can you imagine? You leave your lower body, you know, someone would probably do nasty things with your lower body. And when you come back, <laughs> there's nothing you can do. That's the funny story that is circulating <laughs> right now, right? Orb of Remember? intellect, yeah, but I think it's just a it's just a cap. It's just a troll. Grit I know. Has increased. But it's quite funny if you think about it. Alright. So you have plus five grit if you use orb of intellect. Okay, last but not the least, one from the earth magic. Here we go. Oh no, he died again. Okay, more burgers. It seems like an overkill to be honest. I know, right? But it doesn't last forever. You have to keep getting that buff, especially after you die. And you need to be in there, you know, because you're using a melee weapon, so you need to be in there. You need to hit the bosses. <laughs> so I think it's just a fair trade because they can also one-shot you if they want to. Especially if you're playing within the limitations of AOC. Not more than 120. So not more than 120. I think you will have 1,200, 1,300 HP. <laughs> so I think you're just going to get one or two hits. <clears throat> Yeah, I also like, you know, melee. I usually just get in there, especially if I get the chance. Vitality, of course. All right. How much did you give me for vitality, sir? Plus five sir. on vitality if you have the orb of life. Well, from the name itself, the orb of life. That's Arr. fair. Arr. 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 All right. So those are all the orbs. And uh, to recap, hold on. Let me just remove the blood on my screen. Oh, what well, I stuck your blood. So these are all the orbs that you can craft from Elvenor. Now, make sure that you're looking at the colors of the magic as well that they represent. So from Elvenor, you can craft Orb of Faith, Melee Damage... Orb of Clarity, I forgot, Orb of Life, Additional Vitality, <laughs> and Orb of Mysticism plus Agility. I forgot the Clarity, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, you can just review the video. <laughs> now for all the orbs here, this is from Elvenor, Orb of Intellect, Orb of Purity, I think that's the one that cleanses poison and curse, Orb of Love for Water Breathing, and Orb of Vision. I also forgot. Make love, not war. Now for the Cold Embrace, you have the Orb of Death. <clears throat> you have the Orb of Plague, Plague Protection. You have the Orb of Frost, Magic, Damage Increase. And you have the Orb of Blood, plus five on Strength. All right. So, all in all, there are 12 orbs. Three factions can craft them. Now, that goes without saying that if it's a faction craft, you need to go to your feats in, under knowledge. And then you go to religion. And then you have to unlock your faction T1, T2, T3, something like that. So it will be builds, armors, weapons, craftables. So they have like construction T2, construction T1, and you can find them under. So for example, for Order of Elvenor, um, let's try to find the orbs. Where are the orbs in Elvenor? Mm -hmm. Let's try to find them. You 
Ding dong. Bing bong. Here we go. It's under T4 items. Here. T4 items. Um, assortment of Templar items. So there we go. Faith, clarity, life, mysticism, and then it will tell you where you can craft them. That's the basic woodworking bench from um, all the factions. All right, now for the Order of Felgarth, so it should be in T4 items as well. There we go. Orb of Vision, Orb of Purity, Orb of Love, Orb of Intellect, also from Woodworking Bench. And from the Cold Embrace, it should be T4 item as well. And you will find your orbs here. Blood, Frost, Plague, and Death. Clarity and Faith in different color. Hold on. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Faith and clarity. Actually, that's why I was also doing it like this. They have a different shade. So, if it is, and maybe you guys can try it. If it is really different, maybe this is fire. Maybe uh, Elvanor can tell us. Hold on. Yeah, it's almost not noticeable. Correct. Let's see. No, we cannot see the. We cannot see the. You know, additional information. But yeah, maybe you guys can because they have somehow like a different shade. Hold on. Oh, maybe if we change we change it to night, that's good. Okay, hold on. Let's make it into night. Freeze the day to dusk. How about dawn? Yeah, they do have oh, they have a different shade, guys. Look. So let me let me open one thing. I still have the cheat sheet here. Let me go cheat sheet. to, yeah, cheat sheet. Let me go to Elvanor. And then I will check the orbs. Orb. This is Orb of Clarity, right? Orb of Clarity. It's fire, guys. Over of Clarity is fire. There we go. For those who have, you know, seen it earlier and we thought it's under divine, this is fire. Okay, thank you for catching that. So all the elements are here. Like, yeah, I was also wondering. Like, everything, everything's here, but fire is not here. That would be, you know, at least one for, for air, at least one for um water no two actually for water at least one for earth so there should be at least one for fire yeah pretty close in color especially if it's you know um morning all right so that is actually fire all right cool we tested everything you know what they're for you know where they're from you know what to master to get them 100 percent tweaking the color would be cool yep don't worry s pen is very reasonable with changes so, I believe Espen is still in the chat. So, yeah. Um, Espen, they're recommending that maybe a different shade for fire so that it will be clear. Maybe on the next patch. Um, I need to remove my admin. No, I'm not in god mode. I'm okay to remain in admin. I should not just, you know, use it, overuse it just like before. Oh, by the way. Before we started the um, the game today, our save data was corrupted. So Oz was freaking out because if that was corrupted, it will probably be the end of the series because we have to go back to the like. Even though the the building is admin spawn, we pretty much you know still put them together. We did not just copy and paste them. The good thing is I was able to save um, 
I was able to save it, but I will blame too much admin usage, especially for, you know, teleport <clears throat> would usually cause a lot of issues. So I'm very thankful that I was able to, to save um, the file before we ended last time. Are you hosting a private server, by the way? No, not really. Uh, me and us are just using it for um, streaming and for tutorials. I will probably not host also. I will not take on that responsibility. We tried. We tried before. And it's not easy to keep a server. You need your full attention. You need... Your full attention if you want to have a server. For someone who has uh, a full-time job, I don't think it would be... I don't think it will be healthy for both sides, me and my joiners. Because I have to be there all the time. And if ever they need help, um, they need someone there all the time. And I cannot just simply do that for now. It's all. Uh, it also varies on the location of the map. Um, what post-process volume is used. Each zone uses different saturation and color grading, so a certain color can be easy to see in one location, maybe hard to... That, that is also a good point. Mm, very true. It is a lot to handle indeed, I know. Server is not an easy, you know, easy task. You cannot just um, rent the server and then just put it there, no. You have to address questions, you have to address um, bugs, glitches, you need to compensate whatever they lose. Um, if ever they're playing in the server and God forbid you are working, um, you need to be there. You need someone to be there to pull them out wherever they're trapped or stuck. You need to compensate them if they lost something. You need to deal with a lot of drama and a lot of bullshit as, uh, as well sometimes because some people don't read the guidelines of the server and then they will end up complaining later. So yeah. I'm okay to remain in admin. I'm not in god mode. I will just not do TPs as much as possible. But if I need to, yeah, um, we'll, we'll do that. Okay. I need to be not encumbered. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> Elixir of numbing. Oz, can you spawn me Elixir of numbing? Oh. Elixir of numbing. I need a lot because... I keep on getting, you know, encumbered. I have to carry these things and my armor is freaking heavy. 20. Is it enough? Yeah. Thank you. Well, where do you want me to uh, Just put it, it in my inventory. <laughs> okay, oh. let me just make it morning. Make it morning. Boom. <clears throat> let there be light. <laughs> uh, I'm just, I'm just gonna drop it. Here, here. Take it. Okay. There. Okay, now we're gonna try some of the patch highlights. So, I'm gonna go... Throw some orbs. This... This orb thingy is very controversial. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, are we gonna ride Tesla? Okay, let's ride Tesla. At least Honey will be happy. To see that Tesla is still alive. Where is Tesla though? Uh oh. No, Whoa, we're having here, a man. roof. Man. Yo. Tesla's here. here Where? Here, here. Where did you put Tesla? Why? Near your boat. Oh. <laughs> Let me get this because I'm not in gun mode. Here. Did you did you check our prison already? <laughs> Hold on. Vessel's here. Let me get my let me get let me get my heels. Hello, Tesla. Where's your prison? Let me see. There. Where? Here, here. Oh, we have a dungeon. It looks like stables. Whoa! Oh, he's angry. Oh, oh shit! Wouldn't be angry. Why are you opening it? Don't open it! 
Hey, what is an elven doing in there? Did he commit any crime or you just, you know, profiled no, him just... differently because he's an elven? No, he just need a place to crash. Okay, so this one is mad though. I think you caught him. <laughs> now he said like, I'm too old for this shit. <laughs> no, he just uh, he was saying that he just you know drank a lot that so night. So where is he didn't mean doing? You where know, is the the horrible. warden? Why why is there no warden? I'm not done yet. Sorry. <laughs> there are more. Uh, <laughs> if you have here. some time on stream, do underwater cavern without god mode. Would like to see what you think of the new <laughs> changes. Here we go. Okay, I will go. Yes, I have to go there because um, Oz told me that the second cavern seems to have been rearranged. And you asking me not to be on god mode, so yeah. Uh-oh. <laughs> so I know what you're play you know, you have placed in there, um, S Pen. And here, um, there's more up here. Uh, it's empty. We have no renter yet. How much are they paying for rent? Whoa! <laughs> is this the lady's um prison? <laughs> so our prison is not co-ed? Okay. New underwater cavern video? Nah, not anytime soon. I will wait until Espen will tell me that everything's good. And then I will make new videos. I'm just waiting for, you know, I'm just waiting for the man's word. And then that's it. <laughs> Can I have him? He's really mad. I think he's a good fighter. Is he just a regular T1? It, no, it's a thespian. <laughs> oh, it's a thespian. What the hell? Yeah. <laughs> I thought it's an actual thrall. Oh, it's a thespian. And then you just put an emote. This one is thespian yep. too? <laughs> uh, the other one's a thespian too, yeah. yeah. Thespian also. But the, I thought you, you got some emotes girls? already. Hey, you make a warden, us. You have you need to have a warden. Yeah, yeah. It's weird that you have a prison without a warden. <laughs> Alright, where's Tesla? Come here. And then I'm bringing these boys with me. They will be my guards. My favorite pets. Oz will be bringing um, mages during the fight. They're right, here. But before they're that, here. But before that, we're going to check the the things that I know about the patch. It's Eldor and Eldran. Eldor and Eldran. <laughs> <laughs> because they're elders. so. Um, they're using divine magic and then retribution. Yeah. Okay, cool. All right, and then we'll go to underwater cavern without God mode. Oh, I am not in God mode anymore, so I can I can get wrecked anytime soon. If someone will hit me hard, hit me, baby, one more chance. Oh my God, this place stutters. Um, what's ah because of the treasures <laughs> and the pets also in the area. Every time yeah. I get near the treasure place, I stutter. I know. That's okay. I feel that too. That's the only place anyway. So that's cool. Alright, let's throw some orbs to the lumberjack. I think it's a lumberjack here. Did I see Shiva? Yes, that was Shiva. <laughs> oh, fisherman. Okay. My favorite part! <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Espen. Hold on. Where is it? There, there was into it. <laughs> come here, come here, come here, come here. <laughs> oh my god. I'm where the storm holds are. I'm I'm trying to tame the fisherman. Here, I'm here. Okay, hold on. Listen to this. Hey, fisherman. <laughs> <laughs> There's a fart. <laughs> oh my god. 
I understand why a lot of people are mad. And I'm so Is it is it is it bad that I feel happy they're mad? I think it's bad, right? I have a very different moral inclination, so you guys tell me. <laughs> I'm so happy they're mad. Oh my god. Oh, I know. The reason why the reason why um Espen disabled it, Gohibas, is because they're abusing it with high tier thralls. Um the same with the others, I'm okay if this is being used for low tier thralls, especially vanilla ones, but skipping skipping all the contents and no risk taken in high level thralls in high level camps, I don't think it's right. And then Espen and the team. And I think you can also use this in if I'm not mistaken, you can also use this in VAM and um, IWA. So yeah, like those modders work so hard to make your work progression. And then here you go, you go inside a camp without any risk taken and then you come out with a big reward. Doesn't sound right to me. That's why I'm so happy when people are mad when that was changed. And if Espen does not want to, you know, put it back. I'm okay with that. I don't freaking care. <laughs> if you will watch me with my playthroughs, I got my thralls from T6 to T9 with a trungeon. And experiencing deaths. Did I feel good? Hell yeah. Felt so good every time you do it correctly. Um, make it remain and trigger aggro. Yes, that's actually my first request to Espen. But it, I, I think Espen is still finding a way that it will cause damage. Um, maybe to also be fair for those who were mad. <laughs> we can put it back, but at least not as easy as throwing without any risk. Okay. So that's the purple orb. Let's start with Ikaratosh. Karatosh is here. Oz, did you already interact with this thing or this is still like yapping? Nah, just yapping. What? Uh, the green enough. tablet. Um, there is a glowing thingy out. here. Did you already interact with this? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to tell you. If you have learned the deep uh, okay. connection it will teleport this you is... straight okay there we go well, she already said it that's it but i did not i did not say where okay i did not say where okay i will say where okay <laughs> this is the deep connection orb this thing this thing is the orb um i don't know how to learn it yet but we know what the orb is for so every time What the heck? What? Huh? Shit! What? I thought they killed like a, a deer, a bombie. What the fudge? <laughs> <sighs> okay, where was I? So yeah, the name of the the name of the feat or attunement that you need to learn is deep connection. It has. Uh, the, there are there are two things I can tell you. Um, it's related to earth magic. That's one. Spoiler. And, and the second thing okay. is it teleports you. However, me and us, we haven't found the, the crystal, the tablet, or feats yet. We don't know how to learn it yet. But we know what it's for. Now, for those who want to learn it, in five, four... Three, spoiler alert. Two, one. Look away now if you don't want to hear it yet. This will teleport you to the Earth Shrine immediately. If you have already learned the orb, uh, the uh, Deep Connection Orb, every time you find this, you go into it and it will teleport you to the Earth Shrine. Okay? The Shrine where you need to ascend. Where you need to attune. So my theory, you will find you will find the attunement, you will find whatever thing that you need to learn for your feats to activate 
it is related to early stages. Okay? It is related to early stages in the game where... Because Earth Magic is considered to be a starting magic. And I think Espen saw me run, you know, back, back and forth going to the NPC and shit. <laughs> the NPC is here, guys. And here is the... <laughs> the shrine so maybe espen saw that when i was doing that playthrough and he decided if it was not yet a plan before i will place a certain magic that will allow earth magic users or learners that have interacted with the deep connection to already tp directly to the altar and not suffer you know going back and forth without the using uh the usage of any teleportation device so yes that's what it's for but we haven't found how to learn it yet okay just to make it clear but we know what it's for Oz discovered what it's for don't ask me how she did it because she's a cheater <laughs> she will react i really thought Oz will react okay. i said shut up <laughs> oh Oz, can you give me a uh, an orb of light i forgot my orb of light I will show them what changed in the Ikaratosh. Hold on. Ikaratosh. So you don't need to jump the pillars. Yes, if you have been, uh, if you have already learned this, then you don't have to do the jumping, jumping. And you don't need uh, to do the jumping, jumping because there's something that Espen placed in there. Yep. Okay, I'm waiting for the orb of light. Okay, orb, purple Lula's orb. Let's just throw that away. There. I was mega confused how to get there. Don't worry. This is my first time to get in here as well. And possible end up a shark. There we go. Yeah, she, he added a shark. He added a shark in the water. <laughs> <laughs> as if under, as if the under the underwater cavern isn't enough. <laughs> well, I like it though. At least there's a risk. More risk, more fun, I think. <laughs> um, chat, th I know this is for vanilla. What does this what does this thing do? Mm -hmm. Okay, so now it looks different. It it looks wider now. So there should be a shark in the water. Uh, Oz told me you need to really get near. The shrine's there. Uh, go, go to your, go to your left. The shrine's there, so everything here is not climbable, so you really need to do the puzzle. I can see the shark there. Oh, wait, wait, ma'am, ma'am. Did yeah. you check the right side, like the most right side? Mm, here. Right to your right, like to the very ah! right corner. I see you. I see the shark. <laughs> yeah. You will be, the term is petrified. <laughs> How many seconds is this us? I didn't time. I Lisa! Did <gasps> Let me go, Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that was quite long. What the hell? Yeah, the ICU girl is here. I almost died from it. I, uh, what? The damage was just one per tick. I don't think Lisa should kill you because Lisa cannot be fought. Here, go to your left now. Okay, the shark is there. Uh, sorry, the sharks are there. So... Oz told me that you need to get near this one. Oh, go to the left corner. Go to the left corner. Ah, jump pad. Okay, hold on. Yeah. Not the pillar. Okay. Uh, I hope I have the air magic, so I'm not going to die. Let's see where it tosses me. Oh, okay, good. Oh, so for so for those who are thinking you still have to swim. 
Espen, you are a sadist. <laughs> uh, the talisman of Ikaratosh. Oh, sorry, I got it. Damn it. That's for a sub faction. Oh, no, not sorry. So not sub faction. No, that is for a, a, a quest. A quest. Faction item. Shit. It's. It, no, it's just a basic. Yeah, I know. But uh, I still got it. Item. I might have yeah. to come back here. All right, so here. So the deep connection orb will transport you directly here. So we're still trying to figure that out. All right. We're still trying to figure that out. But whoever knows it. Whoever knows, let me know in the, you know, the comment section. I don't mind spoilers. I'm only, I'm, I'm actually okay. I, I am just, you know, waiting for you guys to actually tell me. <laughs> Jaeger Maester, thank you so much for the sub. <laughs> Prime baby. There we go. We're having two notifications. I don't know why. But I've been experiencing that for for how many months now? But I'm okay. At least we're over celebrating, not just celebrating. Thank you so much for the prime, Jaeger. All right. Jaeger. Jaeger. Okay, I think there's no more jump pads, so we have to really swim this time. Screw the sharks. <laughs> ah! I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, that shark really has like a, a very long snout, Espen. <laughs> Alright. Now, as I've mentioned before, I haven't really figured out the passive for Earth. However, I have learned the passive for water magic. There are two passives now for water magic. We're gonna try it here since we're already in the water. Okay, Oz, can you have a stopwatch? I will just say start and stop. Wait, wait, wait. On your phone. It's okay. Yeah, yeah. On my phone, on yeah. my phone. Yeah, let's... Uh... Okay, I'm all ready. Just say... Hold when on, to let start. me just let the... The Sharkos pass. So, the first passive for water magic is breathing underwater. The second passive for water magic is faster swimming. The more you ascend, so ascension one, a little faster, ascension two, a little faster, ascension three, faster, the fastest is ascension four. So now, I'm going to swim. I'm going to swim without water magic. I can see my eyeballs. Okay. No water magic. Oz. Okay. I will go one, two, three, start, okay? Okay. One, two, three, start. Okay. Hello, Sharky. Just stop, okay? Hmm. Stop. How many seconds? 18.93 18.93 Now I will equip my water magic As you can see my water magic is uh, highlighted mm -hmm. I need you to remember that time How much? 18 Wait, wait. 18.93 Hold on 18.93 Now let's see I have I have a max uh, maxed out um, Air I'm um, sorry not air Water magic And let's see mm -hmm. How many seconds is the difference Ready. One, two, three, start. Start. Even the animation will tell you this is a, a, a lot faster. Stop. Stop. It's 13.12. That is 16 out, uh, 16, that's 16 seconds. Oh no, six seconds difference, sorry. You said the first one was 19 or 18.93. 18. And the second one is? 13.12. Okay, let's do it again. Tell me when you're ready. 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 One, two, three, go. Start. Start. 
So if this is consistent, I would still be getting 13 ish. Or 12 ish or 14 ish. And stop. Stop. 14.85. There we go. So <laughs> if you are equipped. Yeah. Ouch. Stupid <laughs> shark. So yeah, it's a lot faster when you are um, swimming with the water magic. So that's the second passive. And Espen also confirmed that with me. So she, he didn't give me any hints at all. He wants me to suffer. He wants us to suffer. <laughs> uh, no, he wants us to have fun. Kidding aside, the reason why we are very careful with spoilers, even in the Discord channel for AOC, we really, if we answer questions and it's a spoiler, we really block. We block the the text. And for those who want to see the spoiler, they can click on the, you know, uh, the shaded part. But Espen is one of those, you know, um, people that you ask, he will answer. But if you don't, he wouldn't give you any hint so that you can have fun as well. I didn't ask him. I just told him that we found this and that. And... I want to confirm it if it's true and he said yes that is the second passive for water magic it's faster swimming um i will still show him he did not react with the earth magic so I, it means that's probably correct um for the um or was that the deep the deep connection for the earth magic i will show the tornado as well later on all right let me check the patch let me see if i missed something important that i wanted to show Hold on. So we, we have seen what the purple orb already does or not do. And I love it. Um, Certificate of Exotic Animals. Specialty Farming. Uh, Magic Shrine Animation. We will be able to see this again once we do the proper playthrough because we will be learning magic again. Um, We will check the trigger pad later on. For the underworld, because we will be doing dungeons. Um, Van Gul grunts, no more glitching, fixing the exploits. Okay, it's time to go. It's time to go unnamed city because we have a lot to check in there. Okay. Apparently, there are several shrines for earth magic. I've found three so far. Oh. Are you talking about the Earth Shrines inside the Faction Hall? It's nighttime here in Norway. Good night, Jaeger! Thank you so much for joining and thank you so much for the sub and the follow as well. Love it. We have different viewers all around the world. I will catch the rest on y uh, on on YouTube later. Definitely, I will have timestamps in there as well. Good night. Good night. All right. So let's go unnamed city. Ow! Ow! Oh my god! I'm getting poked. You're getting poked. I'm getting poked. Hold on. What's happening? <laughs> What's happening? Who is this guy? Oh, I think this is vanilla. Okay. Get out of the way, punks. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm trapped. <laughs> there you go. I told you many times about that. Oh no. I may have to use Bloody TP. Aim. Yeah. Maybe they're gone now. Oh no, they're stuck there. Anyway, I will just restart my game later before we go dungeons. So... In the unnamed city, I can check the exploits that Espen fixed. And I can also check the 
uh, certificate of something. And this is why I don't pets uh, like pets and thralls. I know it could, uh, they could get stuck, man. In in vanilla, they're supposed to have already fixed that when you're already far enough and they TP. But for some reason, they don't TP anymore. Okay. So here. All right. So they already removed the the tome of earth to avoid confusion. So that's good. So no more tome of earth here. Camellia Redwood. Okay, this is where you can get the certificate of animals. Camellia Redwood. My horse is always named Door. That's an accurate name, to be honest. <laughs> okay. okay, I'm buying this. Boom. So this is where you can get certificate of exotic animals. All right. And we will get the silver, as always. We steal it. Okay. These are the exploits that I think Espen was referring to. It, probably this is just some of the exploits. So this is the exploit before. This was climbable before. This was climbable before. Including this. Now, having those climbable, the, the, P, you know, the players who want to cut corners, they will just stay on top. And then they will keep shooting blunt arrows. Or they will keep throwing orbs. Well, there's no sense of being on top if you are throwing orbs because orbs don't aggro. But if they're using some sort of a blunt arrow or they're using the boulder from Felgarth's spell to, you know, concussively knock them down, they will just stay on top. And they are free from any harm. Cheesing to its maximum level. So that's why it's no longer climbable. I'm happy. I'm laughing deep inside right now. Now, you can get up there without climbing. I know you can do double jump probably and it will still reach. But at least if you don't have double jump, at least you don't have um, any option. Now, this one was climbable before. <laughs> well, we were expecting that there will be spikes. I think it was Jamnog who said, next time we come here, this will not be climbable and there will be spikes. Good thing there are no <laughs> spikes. It's not climbable. However... You can still do this. And it's fun. It's more fun doing this. It's more fun in the Philippines. And you can still, you know, interact with Athos without having to fight those guys. However, if you want to attune, you need to fight. Or you need to ascend. You don't, you don't want to fight, you can just jump, suffer the consequences, or have air magic. There we go. So, exploit. Good. No more. Now, let's go with uh, the seeds, something. I, it should be in the, <laughs> the jungle still. If I'm not mistaken, it should be here. With the storm holds, Where storm holds, yeah, are... Someone mm -hmm. was complaining that it's no longer here. Again, every time every time I hear someone saying I don't see the NPC, um, and then I know it wasn't moved, it's usually solo co-op um type of gameplay, not server. So yeah, this guy, McWillen. This is where you get the specialty farming. So I think this is where you need to go buy that thing. So that you can see the seeds in um, the faction hall. Specialty farming, consuming. There we go. And then exotic animals, consuming. And I think that's the reason why you're they're not seeing all the seeds in the faction hall. So you have to, you know. Let's go. Um, I think there is a way to TP. Hold on. How do I TP again? Ah, oh, here. Admin hub, faction <clears throat> hall. I am Johansson. What up? Update time. Oh yeah, we're just checking the patch highlights. So here we go. We are back in the faction hall. Look at my map. It's already black. So it's a sign that 
something good is coming up if I don't restart my game. Uh, merchants, it's here. Here we go. Um, is he the one selling? No, I don't think so. Are you the one selling? This one is for the seeds. There we go. All the seeds are showing up. All right. Um, how about the animal thingy? Da, 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 da. What's the name of the animal thingy, us? Why I need Wait. to go with animal expertise. Why did I have to get the animal book from the lady again? I haven't really used her. Uh, I'm not sure what it actually unlocks. No, I, I can't. Shepherd really is in the guild recall. hall. Ah, so that's for the animal. Thank you, Espan. Shepherd guy, remember on the second floor? Oh, this is Roderick. Shepherd. <laughs> Roderick is the shepherd. I thought I thought the name is really Shepherd. Remember before his name is really Shepherd? I think. <laughs> ah, there we go. Found it, Espen. Oh, you can buy goats. Silkworm? Hold on. So if Shepherd is here, I want to check something. Where's Cold Embrace? Where's my faction here? This place is so ominous. The cold embrace. <laughs> oh dear. Let's check up, uh, upstairs. Um, Espen, the the faction still have um a contractor because if I'm not mistaken, in the old ways. You can buy Shepherd, put him in your base, and you can buy it from the contractor. Let's see. If I can still remember where the contractor is. Yeah. Let's see. Um, I know the waiter is here. Waitress is still here. Okay. Contractor is here. Okay, here. Okay, so there's still a contractor. Survival weapons. Okay, hold on. Okay, Shepard is no longer. So you can go sorcery. 
nothing here. Um, um mm -hmm. the contractors don't do much and will be removed, and the old merchants are accessible through normal means anymore. Um, they're being phased out, and okay, makes sense. So, yeah, because before, um, Shepard is not an actual merchant in the faction hall. Shepard is someone that you can buy from your contractor in every faction hub. But now, you don't have to worry about that anymore because Shepard is already in the faction hall with uh, the guild. Um, um, what do you call that? The guild section. All right, thank you, Espan. So there, that's I have I have an answer to my question already. So Roderick is the name of all you know, the shepherd of all factions. Personal home vendors are gone. Well, shepherd is gone. That's one. I'm not sure with Bobby and Lannis, and then the fashionista lady. The banker, I don't need you. I, I don't think you will need a banker anymore, because you already have you already have a slot. I'm not sure about that though. But the money now is, the money now is in your character right here. You can just deposit them. So you don't really need a banker for, um, and not the banker. Sorry, banker is for PVP. What's the name of that guy? Currency exchange guy. I think that's the master, name. Master of, master of Coins. There we go. Master of Coins before was also bought from the contractor. But you don't need it anymore because of the changes in the currency. Alright. Let me see what else that we can check. Um, I think exploits there's, there's gone. There's like a... Mm -hmm. okay. go. I think there's like a currency flipper or something. I forgot what its name. but There's, a, there's, a, there's an NPC that exchanges mm -hmm. um, currency. I forgot. Um, her name, but she is in the faction hall also with the other merchants. Um, added teleport, new category, point of interest. Okay, let me let's check this one. Admin panel. No. It's in server features. And then server admin. Dungeon teleport. Uh, so you have teleports to Gorkla. Underworld, Forsaken Mountain, Underwater, Midnight Grove, Frost Temple, Skellos, Play, uh, Palace of the Witch Queen, Wine Cellar, Black Keep, The Dregs, War Maker Sanctuary, and Sunken City. Um, location, Heal Eyes, Vanquished Beach, mm -hmm. New Azagarth, um, Unnamed City, Supermaru, The Den. These are like a very good replacements to the Iwa um, waypoints, if ever you don't have Iwa. However, you need to be an admin. To see them uh dungeon teleport okay we're done with that battleground <laughs> i used to play battleground with us she gets mad every time she, she dies wow so it's really me who dies huh <laughs> yes what oh you often die what you that's <laughs> just a blatant lie right there <laughs> stop lying to people Oh no, I'm not. <laughs> okay, so let's learn. Okay, uh, we already have an idea what deep connection is. We just need to know how to learn it. I'm just waiting for you guys. It, trust me, if I know, I will let you know in the video. I will put it in the, I will put it in the pin, you know, comments. But I don't really know, honestly. I was able to figure out. Well, rather, us was able to figure out the tornado mastery. All right, tornado mastery is in the Gore Claw Deep. So we're going to go there. Oz, can you go with me? Because you're the one who found it. Oh. Okay. I'm teleporting there now. I'm also going to teleport yeah, go in there. Hopefully. Yeah, this is just to guide. I'm here. All right, so this is the Gore Claw Deep. Yep. Um, this is the, the location for Gorkla Deep right here. So if you want to find a safe, a safe route, I think you can see it in the map. You can start with F1. Sorry, not F1. You can start with F3. And then work your way on F1. 
We showed that in the previous video, so check that out. Hold on, us. Um, I just need to get something outside. Okay. Hold on, chat. Na na na. Hey. Alright, I'm back. Something happened? While I'm gone? Us? Hello? <laughs> Hello, can can you can you hear me us? Yeah, I can hear you. I'm answering. You no, cannot hear me? Uh, no, I wasn't able to hear your answer. Hold on. What the hell? Wait. Old merchants are being placed in the new system. I think it's a lot better. I like the, I like that the merchants are already in the faction hall. The faction hall is quite big anyway. So, yeah. Da, 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 da. Okay. Hold on. Mama is chatting. So, maybe she's... Asking if we want the food to be delivered. <laughs> Hold on. Okay, there we go. Um, us when the when the kids go crazy, it means someone's outside. You just go out, okay? Okay. And check. Mama's um sending food. We told okay. her that we are streaming. Okay. All right. Uh, I think that's it. We can proceed. So Gorkla Deep. Arguably, arguably the first dungeon, and I would say arguably because some people would actually think differently. So. This is just my own observation. Gorklaw Deep is always going to be the first. I still remember I still remember on how I go about with the order on how I kill the raid uh, raid bosses and Shinara Aluri would always be my first. And that's why I always take Gorklaw Deep first in getting um the boss relics. Okay, so yeah, we go right turn still, the same thing. Okay, the same path, going to the merchant. Mm -hmm. Going to the merchant, sorry. Going to the NPC before. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Wait for me! Shit, my character's hungry. Hold on. Do we kill it or not? Uh, I don't know. You can probably try. We can try. Oh shit, I have no ammo. Why I have no ammo for air? 
Are you kidding me? Oh shit! I would want to hear Gorklaw Deep's, you know, background music in the main menu. There are patrol. So we're looking for a green tornado. Oz found yeah. it. So she's leading me to it now. Watch out. What? It's so weird. It just popped up. 200 285 283 Don't overuse the dome. It's, it's no, too, that's just one. It's just too OP. You don't really need it for, you know, against these guys. I'm getting their potato though. Potato. <laughs> Get their potato. I'm getting their potato. There's okay. one more there. So from the old NPC we go right. Okay, hold on. Let me use another magic. gonna use earth question is i have ammo i don't have ammo go shoot bitch hold on um <laughs> she went melee <laughs> don't kill it yet yeah go mano we mano Three twenty-five for fire they buffed it it was just two something before it's good. I wonder. The blood magic. I wonder. Uh, don't go up. Don't go up? Okay. Hold on, hold on. Mm. Let me kill it. Let me kill it. I'll use fire. Three eighteen and then the full stack damage over time is twenty-eight. Good. 318. Okay, we got our sample. Let's go to. Blood magic. And from here, you should see it already. Yay! We can see the green tornado. And there, that's where you learn it. There we go. So I think we're also looking for the same, you know, thing for the earth magic. I think so. Tornado mastery. So, so okay. And then So now it's time to talk about what they do. So the white tornadoes, the ones that are moving, you can use them to just, you know, probably if you want to escape if you want to jump to a high place, you can use it. You can combine it with the um, the air draft of the air magic so that you don't die when you, you know, almost hit the ground. However, if you can find a green tornado, this is what's going to happen if you go inside it. Thank you, Espen. Thank you very much. It teleports you to the Arcane Hall. AKA Faction Hall as well. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> but damn it, that was so hard to find, Espen. I think, how, how many hours did you spend there, Oz? I don't know. I can't tell anymore. She, 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 she was not, she only, she spent maybe almost an hour in Gorklaw, but she spent hours around the world. She went to the underworld, she went to the underwater cavern. That's why she told me that some of the stones may have been rearranged, but she never told me about the monster. But yeah, I think you also made some changes with uh, uh, the sea monster according to the patch. So that's what the tornado does. So for example, there are green tornadoes in the unnamed city. There are green tornadoes, I think, also in... I'm not sure if in Aloran there is. But if this is all over the map, if you see... A tornado green in shade or color in the map do not interact with uh, interact with it if you haven't learned 
the, the Mastery of Tornado yet. If you have already learned the Mastery of Tornado, then you can interact with the green ones and it will teleport you to the Faction Hall, specifically in the Arcane Hall. There we go. Now, let's check the next patch. Um, Added deep connection orbs yet to be known on how to learn. So if you have already found it, please tell me. Uh, water magic one to five um, passive. It's the it's the faster swimming. The more you ascend, faster the faster you swim. Um, in the water, underwater. Earth magic. We don't know the passive yet. So we were experimenting on um, yield. We were experimenting on buff on HP. It's somehow not the case yet. Um, we were also experimenting on the yield of uh, magic orbs using the sickle. It's not also the case. What else did you um, try, Oz? I also tried using the like the sickle of serenity. That's for the earth magic where you can harvest more power gems. It's not also the case. Yeah. Okay. It's not. But don't worry. It's okay. Um, this is the this is you know what's exciting about the new changes. Um, at least we will be able to find it on our own. So I was just using some hints um, using the patch notes because there were some changes in terms of visuals. So that would be your hint too. If you will go to the patch notes, you will see that the visuals have changes um, in some of the places or um, spots in the map. So feel free to, to check those. Aloran, Outskirts, Underwater Cavern, Gorklaw, we already did. We will check what the sea monster has. Devil Bear Mountain, um, I will try and go there. Uh, probably, I will just run. I will not be in God Mode, but I will just go there. I will run if I get aggro. Uh, Tome of Ekaratosh, we already did it earlier. It was the jump pad. It was a bigger um, pool. There's sharks already, and you have to be careful because, you know, there are two of them. Um, updated the underworld. Underworld will have gargoyles, and also we will try and see if uh, where they place the the jump pad for like if you don't want to handle, you can't handle. You're getting your ass kicked, and you want to escape from Harbinger. There is a a pad that you can use to escape. So is that the underworld or is the temple? Because I went to the temple like earlier. What do you mean temple? There are gargoyles as where, like the temple of Wraith. Where you know it's not really like uh, the it says race underworld. race. It says underworld in the really? visuals. Okay. Okay, so that's yeah. I know that there's dragon also in there. But but there are also gargoyles in there. Yeah, it's it could be because remember you know the lore between harbinger and the actual harbinger in the underworld is just one. Yeah. So it would make sense that the real harbinger has gargoyles and the specter gar uh, the specter. Um, Harbinger also has gargoyle, so it would make sense. Um, that's probably the reason also why the black dragon is there. So it's all about, you know, they're just the same person. I'm just referring to the visuals, like patch note wise. It says updated underworld. Um, so like at least it will give us an idea on where we could possibly learn these things. Um, fighting the scourge dragon yesterday, I got killed by the tornado. Uh <laughs> Nescafe. Oh no. <laughs> Yeah, um, I was not in god mode when I tried to get close to it, and I almost died. Thank god I had the air magic in my inventory. Always have the air magic in your inventory, because that thing is so freaking high. Alright, so we're gonna do underwater now. Oh no, I will go devil bear first. You wanna come with me? Let's just okay. check, not fight. It's not yet time. Okay. You don't okay. have your voice with you, so I don't think it's time. Okay. Okay, I'm just gonna TP admin using the AOC features. It's safer that way. Um. What is the name of Mama Bear's place? Uh, the, 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 the devil something mountain? Like, fine, hold on. Hold on. <laughs> well. <laughs> I 
Oh, there's no teleport for Devil Bear yet. Fine. We can always go there. Maybe Espen On thinks foot. that's not a dungeon. <laughs> well, yeah. Hold on. Oh, yeah. There's really none. Let's just go to F1. I will go Borklo. I will put it on the list. Thank you, Espen. <laughs> it's like, okay, I got it. Put it on the list. Gork. We can go Gorklo, man. man. Uh, let's just kill the two that were aggro. Two will aggro. Just kill them. Gorklo. Eek. Yep, yep. Alright, let's just exit. Hello, Alexandra. Are you lonely? The hell? Yeah, she said she's lonely. Did okay. You? Uh, there are two that we cannot really avoid. However, if you don't have a pet, you can avoid it. Because the pets are the, the reasons why they aggro. Because the pets always pass through, you know, the side. But if the bears are far enough... Ah! I just said if the bear is far enough. <laughs> I'm gonna get Do wrecked. you want me to heal you? No, no. I'll fight it. Okay. We are gonna fight dungeons later, so we need to know if the boys can handle. Wow, that's a very tanky bear. 145. 160, 170. 170 seems to be the cap. Okay. Did you... Did you help fighting? No. Yeah, I did. Ah, don't help next time. I wanna see if the boys can handle it. Fine. Tornado! You just have to make sure that you have your air magic all the time. Yeah, I'm gonna play with it. Hold on. <laughs> Shit! Still hurts. That cub still hurts. I know. Okay, I'm not helping this time. Mm -hmm. 170, 140, 140, 145. So it's like playing between 140 to 170. I'm gonna try and use fire. It's dying though. Yeah, there I'm gonna fight did. the other one. Uh, any idea where the best area to find scourge meat? Scourge meat? Is that a new? Is that a new thing in AOC? A new thing. Good. Scourge meat. I know scourge bosses. I know unstable substance, but scourge meat. I'm not sure. It could be a new thing. Could be. Okay, let's go to Mama Bear. Okay. We will just check what Espen, where Espen placed it. Mm hmm. Maybe, maybe it's just Iwa. Um, for those who are able to play it and familiar with it, please answer Nescafe because, yeah, I haven't heard Scourge Meat yet in AOC. And also, if Espen indeed added Scourge Meat, Espen would let us know. But I haven't heard about Scourge Meat so far in AOC. Okay, Mama Bear. So this is where you find the uh, Elvanor and Felgarth to get your divine book mm -hmm. for the tome. All you need to do is just go straight and then follow the path. You can get to Devil Mountain where Mama Bear is. What's that sound? Mm -hmm. I can hear like sound. Yeah, you will know once you're near nearby. Your follower leveled up. I'm I'm getting damage. What? I'm getting damage. Oh no. Probably is it too cold or what? No. I, I would know. Okay, well, then we just get some encumbrance. Yeah, blizzard. It's just um, one per tick, so that's okay. There's blizzard. <laughs> well, makes sense. This is the top of the mountain. Are there still hounds here, Oz? Did you check it? 
I haven't checked yet. Hold on, I'm going out there. There should be hounds here. Oh uh, yeah, there are. Sometimes it's a mini boss. Sometimes if you are unlucky, it's a boss. They're waiting so, for you. They're just waiting like, for you. I think there's four of them. One, two, three, four. Yeah, you're close. There you go. We'll die in no time. Okay. Oh my god, they melted. Okay. So what we're looking for here, according to us, are crystals. We're not gonna fight. We will fight her later. I doubt you can see it from like far from what afar. I thought it's a door. I also thought. Okay, there's a cub. <laughs> right here. So we will compare the damage. So let's start with fire. Let's just kill, um, I think, three cubs here. Just let me know if you need help, though. Yeah, it's okay. I'm getting 154 for fire. Oh, your HP. Yeah, I know. It's okay, it's okay. Don't, don't, don't. Okay. Now I'm doing blood. Okay. Blood is way higher. 170. And it also bleeds. Okay, good. Now let's compare Detail. that with divine magic, and we have to be careful because divine is—you're uh, basically just standing there. Yep. So we have to be very smart with who's tanking, who's not. So we need to get the boys to get aggro. Once, okay, confirm. They're already aggro. And uh, divine magic. There, see that? That should be the thing. Living organisms, living organisms. <laughs> living, living targets should not have. Oh, sheesh! He flew. <laughs> living targets should have low damage against divine. This is, this is it. This is the old school. I like it. Now, we Ooh, know, we know that. Arcane. How, how's arcane though? Yeah. Ah, uh, it hurts a lot. So. Arcane before was the lot. most painful against the living. So we know now fire magic against bear. So we have we have single target. So it's a very good um, um, benchmark. For the fire magic, we got 143, 140. For the blood magic, we got 170, 150, 170. And then for divine magic, we only got 75. Now we're going to try arcane. And see what Arcane has to offer. We still have one more bear. I think that's a bear? Or it's a stone? Oh, that's a bear. Is it a cub? Sure. Oh, it is a cub. Now, we have to be careful because Arcane is the same as Divine Magic. You're just standing there. Okay, good. Eh? Blood magic it is the higher us. Really? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm seeing one. F oh, 176. What the fudge? I think it will increase because of the DOT as well. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm not looking at the DOT. I'm looking at the raw ah, okay. per tick. The DOT right. is the, you know, the small skeletons popping. Sorry. It's 176 top damage that I've seen. So, yeah. But. Will I sacrifice six points of damage um, with mobility? I think I would still choose mobility. But if you're talking about raw damage, yeah. Did it sunder the I bear? Prefer... Hold on. Did it sunder the bear or the boy sunder the bear? I because know. these boys cause sunder their bites. So it could be the magic. It could be the uh, it could be the boys. We will see. 
and we'll try experimentation later. Ooh. Hold on. They changed it. Hmm? Ah, no, no. We just entered the, the other side. We entered the dragon. Yeah, we entered the <laughs> dragon. Mama Scarget is there. There should yep. be... Where did you find the crystal? It's right with Mama. Oh no, Espen! At the back of Mama. <laughs> yeah, I know the story so here. I'm I know the puzzled. story here. Mama Bear went to the the under uh, the underwater cavern and killed Bjorgel. Ate, ate Bjorgel. <laughs> And injured Mosasaurus. And that's the reason why there's a change to Mosasaurus. I think we will be looking at a, a disabled Mosasaurus. What the hell? Okay. As promised, I'm just gonna run through it. I'm not gonna fight. Oh, no. Yeah, that's very risky, actually, but... And you are riding Tesla. Seriously, ma'am. Yeah. Ah, oh, it's up to you. See you, suckers! Oh no, they're. Uh oh! You aggroed three! Good thing I only aggroed three. Hello? Oh, it's there! Son of a biscuit! <laughs> it's there! <laughs> I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out! So the question is, will I be able to interact with it before Mama actually kills me? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> you know what? You could actually escape if you were using your arcane, I think. Oh, ye oh yes! Hey! Hey, my boys! my boys! My boys! My boys! Oh no, ma'am. Just run! Keep running! Just keep running. There, they're also like going after you now. Thank you. What the <laughs> hell? Espen and his jokes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's there. So yeah, I think the idea of us can work y using your arcane, you know, dash. Probably you can do some dashes. Take care of your stamina. Yeah. Interact. This press escape. Then bolt. So you can dash three times, by the way. Yeah, until like your stamina straight. depletes. <laughs> That's good <laughs> for a change. I just wonder what happened to Bjorgel. <laughs> <laughs> He's, I think, he turned now into fish and chips. <laughs> I forgot what you were looking for. Um, you forgot what you're looking for? No. You didn't forget anything. It's a new thing. It wasn't there before. It's supposed to be in the underwater cavern where the where the mirror man is. You can learn the... What do you call that thing? Eye shards? But now... You have to... You have to go... Um, you don't really have to kill Mama Bear. You can just run. But well, you have to go Mama Bear to get that thing. <laughs> ah, Sven. Why? The blizzard is appearing on the edges where you could normally cheese. Right! That's, that's it. At least you have damage over time. You cannot climb and you cannot heal. Got it. So no cheesing. Smart. Smart. <laughs> well, at least we know Espen hates cheesing. Not hate, but doesn't promote cheesing. Spellcrafter. You have a spellcrafter? Here. Um, There's a spellcrafter yeah? here. Objective. Oh, yes. I forgot. Remember, I came here first time. I didn't have this. Yes, <laughs> I forgot. There we go. We Idiot. Have, uh, well, um... I don't think 
they, um, I don't think they did something with the spellcrafter yet. It's still faster, you know, crafting and no attributes really yet. Or save oh. resources something. Oh. Yeah, here we go. That's some sexy ass spellcrafter. I thought witches are like, <laughs> they become crooked or something. Not true. Not smooth. Okay. I think it's underwater cavern time. That's the only thing we haven't checked. And then underworld. We will check the underworld, aka Harbinger, once we are already doing dungeons. But now we go underwater cavern and see what changed. I will not be in god mode, I promise Espen, because I think he has something for me in there. <laughs> I'm just gonna make sure that I have my bedroll <laughs> ready. <laughs> <laughs> okay, then that being said, I'm, I'm gonna TP manually so that I can put my bedroll and my pets down. Okay, here. I am going there now. So we're gonna leave Tesla. Make sure. Um. Oh, us. What? Do you remember the the spell the, for water can heal? Uh, blessing of. Yeah. Can you can you give me that? Because that's the only the that's name. the only heal we have because I don't have the soup. Blessing. Of Corthina. Orthina. Orthina. Blessing of Orthina. Make sure How you have many? your... Are you going to be on God mode? Let's not be on God mode. Don't no, cheat. I'm not on God mode. So that we Actually, can get one, on, you know, one shot. <laughs> I am not on God mode. So I'm also placing my bedroll. Well, we are removing all the God modes and admin once we are doing dungeon. So you will yep. be able to see what's doable and what's not. Like how okay. difficult, how easy. Da, 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 da. Let can, me just place my. We can roll. already pre-qualify those. It's easy. It's difficult. Remarks. Look, look at my fiber bedroll, ma'am. <laughs> so cute. I see sticks I, and fiber. I am. I am so poor. There, I dropped it. It's in here. So this is the only magic that works underwater for healing. That's why I'm using it. Mm -hmm. And I will be, I will be equipped with the ones that matter. Here we go. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. We're gonna equip this with healing, and we're good. All right. Double checking that we are not in God mode. Nothing is checked. Just. Eating hungry something. We make sure that it's noon outside. Well, it doesn't matter because once we get in there, it's dark. And then I'm gonna go orb. Water I'm has going. healing spell. Uh, ever since um, Earth has water has. We covered all the healing potion. Uh, all the healing spells. Oh, Actually, shit. we covered all the spells in our last playthrough. And it gave, it gave, well, Espen gave me the idea how to use the ward, and it gave him the idea what to do with the ward after. Sneaky Espen. It's really good though. The passive of that ward is so good. I didn't know about that before. When I played water. When was the last time you played? Ever since, ever since I know AOC. Water al always has healing, including Earth. Wow. Oh. oh my god! <laughs> the hell? Are we good? Are you getting yeah. missions from her? <laughs> no. Okay. I'm going down. Here we go, Espen. I hope you will be happy with this. <laughs> like a year? Well, I, I I'm playing AOC for two um for more than two years, and it's been there. So I'm not sure. Maybe you just missed it. I wouldn't blame you though, because water healing was not very popular. I'm stuck, Oz. I'm stuck. Yeah. Can Hold on, let me just pull you with the pull me. I am stuck! <laughs> there! <laughs> Sheesh! Hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Well, one thing I'm comfortable with thinking is, as long as it's not the Meg, as long as it's not the Mosasaurus, it will not one hit me. That's the comfort I want to believe in. So let's go. So I will follow the same route I always do. Yeah, do yours. Your your same route thing. So midway, first cavern. Stalagmites and tall weed. Okay, there we go. Uh, the shark Bruce. is still um, lower level. I go up a little bit. And stalagmites, tall weed. Okay, we are in the right place. And it should be the second hole. There we go. Second hole. All right, nothing much changed in the first cavern. Let's uh, see if something changed in the second cavern. Second cavern still eel. Got it. I will follow the same thing that I always do. Swim low and swim straight. Hit the wall, go up. The Soros should be in this location. Second cavern. If the Soros is already swimming low now, yeah. Now I understand why Espen wants me to come here. Okay, hit the wall, go up. And, um, no us. It's not changed. It's the same. This is not the okay. change that Espen was talking about, I believe. The sharkies there. I, ne I will never play Vanilla Conan again. I have been playing AOC for a long time myself. I think it, it will get a little bit stale if you will play Vanilla and you have already played a lot of mods. So, Quantus, aka Arcane Guy, is still here. Hey, us. <laughs> I see you. Go near her. Go near no, her. No, no, I want to shoot it. Let's see if there's something I can do with this girl. No way. No, you can't. Did I just heal He's her? He's already dead. Why are you still... <laughs> what the? Who knows? If you heal the dead, they might be alive. They might give you a bonus. We might learn the deep connection Shut shit. Ma'am, I can hear the Masa Soft thing. Masa Soft. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yes, if you are low level, you get so near. There's like four per tick. I would understand Gohibas if you will die or almost die. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she uh, back about 30 minutes. Okay, Ash. Wherever you're going, please be careful. All right. Be careful. Let's see what the Saurus has become. Okay, hold I don't see its silhouette, ma'am. Can, uh, can we still see? Oh my god, okay. One thing I realize is that the the NPC and at the same time the tome for water. What's that sound? I think that's him. Oh, the who's him? Thing. I was level 10. Oh, <laughs> it ate 90% of your shit. <laughs> Why? What? I can see the shark. Uh, I want to go but check. But not the mosa. Um. Well, if you cannot hear the mosa, then it's a good sign. Hold on. The shark is about to circle around. Mosa should be here. I want to observe from behind it, what they change. So I want to see the tail and then jump in. Come on, Mosa, Mosa, Mosa. Where is it? Can you hear it on your end? No, I don't. Probably it's still there where the no. NPC is. What? What? It <laughs> held. Let's wait. Thank God for the orb. 
Use the short key. Be because that masa thing. Okay, they're no longer stuttering. Just a little, you know, there's a little stutter, rubber band, but it's not the same as before. They're really slow. I can hear it. It's coming. It's coming, ma'am. It's wait, coming. Wait, 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 wait. That's it. it. That could be it. It's a stone. From that area. There, he's, you can he's... hear it. No, not yet. He swims mid-level. That's what I know. And he swims really slow. I can hear it. I can uh, hear it. No, I think that's not Mosa. That's like a sea monster. Like maybe Burgle. That's... What the hell? No, it's not. Man. Oh no, you cannot see him anymore. I think he's swimming like really low. Oh, there, 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 there. I see the Mosa. Oh, there. Okay, hold on. Let me... Uh... I'm risking my life now. There. Uh, Here, man. Yeah. There. What up, Mosa? What do you have? Do you uh, have something cool? Something different? Hello? Uh, no, Mosa is still the same size as us. Uh, there's a shark going there, man. I'm going up. I will go to the NPC and also the the water tone. Yeah, I will stay here. <laughs> what the heck? You're cheating. I'm too, I'm too scared. <laughs> Again, as long as it's not the Mosa, as long as it's not the Meg, if 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 Espen did not maniacally change it, it's not gonna one shot you. That's what you have to always think. Mm -hmm. Nope. The starlight spell? Oh yeah, the one that sticks on the wall. <laughs> yeah, let's put some LED lights underwater. <laughs> What's updated for the Mosa is the attack animation. Okay, someone has to get attacked so that we can see the action. Oh no! <laughs> I'm, I'm fine with it. We don't have the drop item anyway, Yeah, we don't have so. the drop item. So, what? Do, do you want um, me to die no, or you I die? Will, I will sacrifice myself. Hold on. <laughs> I need to I need to check first before... That's oh gross. my goodness! What? They... Espen changed the route of the Mosa as well. Yeah. I saw the Mosa surfaced. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, because the Mosa doesn't go here before. And Espen saw that the first the last time we did. So he made it come here. <gasps> he's actually turning, like making his rounds. Yeah, there he's already. making his rounds wider. Okay. Okay, I will sacrifice myself. I might get <laughs> one shot though. There we go, he's laughing. <laughs> You're like, oh shit, they found out. Yeah, because the Mosa doesn't come here before. I only worry about the shark here before. I'm gonna have heart attack. Okay, the earth tome, uh, the earth tome. Water tome is still here. She's still here. Are you sure it's the same fish? Yeah, because of the tail. But it could be a different monster. Who knows? I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait for my death. Here we go. If I don't die one shot, then we're good. We can continue swimming. <laughs> where, where is where is it? Here. Here, Mosa, 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 Mosa. Here, boy. It's a snake. <laughs> Bruce. Here, Mosa, Mosa, Mosa. Bite me! Bite me! Oh, it looks creepy. Ooh, one shot almost! Climb, 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 climb! <laughs> <laughs> so the answer to our question, is it the same fish? Oh yeah, that's the same shit. That crocodile and whale that made a baby, that's the look of it. The animation was, it opens its mouth? Are you telling me that it didn't open its mouth before? 
Okay, I know this is just a game, but I don't like that feeling. It's scary. Okay, we're healing. We're healing. <laughs> oh, it didn't open its mouth before. Now you can see the mouth open. So it's scarier now. What the hell? We go. It took a chunk out of my ass, S Fan. It's cute. I wonder how it tastes. What the heck, Gohibas? That's messed up. <laughs> well, yeah. Eat them before they eat you. Huh. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, I will ask Espen, though. Espen, the, the Soros, it's still not going to matter what armor you're wearing, right? It's the percentage of your HP still. It's here again. Because I want to feel Hello. comfortable about that as well. That those things will not one hit you regardless of your armor. Even though you're naked. Okay, see, it's still HP percentage based. See, Oz told you, even though you're naked, if you're hit once, it's not going to kill you. But it uh, almost will. Especially if there's another shark or a spike that will hit you, that will kill you. I think that's what happened to me as well. I got mobbed yeah. by multiple attacks. But if it's just one attack, it's percentage base. Okay. Let's go to the next cavern. Espen, are we clear? Is there something you want me to check here? Or is it just the Sora's um, route and animation? I think the third cavern will have more juicy things in it. Um, you can continue. That's it for the Mosa. All right, good. But we have to make sure the Mosa is not here. <laughs> Oz, well, can you, you tell can me if the tell. Mosa is there? No, it's not here. It's somewhere far. Oh, sheesh. So, you can hear it, though. I'm not sure why is it that you cannot hear it. <sighs> Sometimes my audio is bugged. Oh shit! I can hear it! Mm. Please no, not like this. Oh no! Oh, it's just right behind no, 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 no! Yeah, I can hear it! <laughs> <sighs> you wanna try? It was just right behind you! You wanna try? It opens its mouth. I no, I don't want to. Do you remember do you remember getting swallowed by the Valheim serpent? Yeah. It's worse I don't than like that. that feeling. I think I if you are like... in front of it, it's worse than that. Okay. Now let's go to the third cavern. Let's uh, swim around. Let's see what Espen added in there. Okay. Uh Mosa clear. I can hear it. No, I think it already passed. Let's uh, equip our water magic so that we are faster. Hold on. I think I made a boo-boo. Boo-boo has been made. Oh, uh, like that boo-boo. Okay, hold on. No! I did not make a boo boo, Espen, you son of a gun. He changed I told the you. He changed the entrance. I told you. Ah! <laughs> you sneaky bastard. Is it th is it this? Come here, Oz. Huh? Come here. I found a yeah. like a little hole. Here. Uh. I cannot see you. Oh no. Why did you not follow me? I'm sorry. I can see you now. Hold on. Okay. Um there's a there's a crack here. Look. Let's see if this is the passage. If there is a <laughs> big mouse catching me here, that wouldn't be great. <laughs> it's just uh spikes. Oh yeah, yes, you su you sneaky, sneaky bastard! 
You blocked it. He blocked it. You just have I to know. go. You just have to go around it. He blocked it. Oh my goodness. Okay. A lot of people will be mad about that, S fan. <laughs> Again. Oh, I just but love, I'm not. I just love it when they get mad over something very trivial. <laughs> Is it wrong? <laughs> All right. Okay. So yeah, here we go. <laughs> but I'm still scared down here. Uh, well, I told you, as long as Espen will not have like a barbaric idea of making the shark, you know, randomly swim up and down. Hold on. Oh no. Uh. What? This stone is supposed to shut already. This is supposed to be the the skeleton whale. This is supposed to be where Björgel is. Björgel is gone. Bro. I know. I'm just telling you. That thing there, this thing, was not here before. <laughs> this 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 pile of ruins is not was not here before. You know what's here before? What? Shutter. Skeleton. It's here. Skeleton's still here. So I think. This is more of like a safe spot. Hold on. Safe spot and then I, I'm gonna get myself I, nipped. I can see the shark actually swimming right behind me. Uh that's a friendly shark. Nope. That was Bruce shark. Brucey. What I yeah. Alright, so here we go. Um, Where are you should now? be the face statue here. Come back where the ruins I uh, was is. No, there's a shark, ma'am. Hold on. I can see it. Oh, it's turning back. What the hell? Hmm. You said the face where I can learn the Bainaker or something? Yeah. Right? Okay, I'm going there. Just checking. Um, the same point uh, of interest. I'm, I'm going I'm up here? to check if the air magic is still here. Yep, shit! Woo! Oh, shit. <sighs> uh, one shark down, one shark up. It was just behind my cute little ass. Uh, I'm safe. Cloud of Storm? Ah, uh, is this the name? I think. That's where you get the dome. Is that shark bigger? Or the I same? Think. I think just the same. They still bite. <laughs> they still bite? <laughs> okay. Yeah. You wanna find Bobby? To see yeah. what Bobby is up to. Okay, hold on. Oi! I got stuck. Okay. Still the same thing here. Okay. Uh, I don't know where you swam now. Um, inside the face. Inside the face. Where um, the bane was. Okay. Okay. Um, we're gonna look for Bobby. Oh my god! <laughs> I hate that! <laughs> heal me! Heal me, bitch! <laughs> oh, sheesh! Oh. Oh. I'm dying! I'm dying! Hold on, hold on! I'll take care of that. Hold on, Chad. Hold on. What the fuck? I her. Damn.
Okay. Oh my god. It was like also a perfect timing that someone came and the the boys are barking and at the same time I was panicking already because the shark was right behind me, the other one. And the one that I had in my face took a chunk out of my I think it took a chunk out of my out of my head. <laughs> Ooh, that was some aggressive sushi. I know. Hold on. Let me look for Bobby. Ow! Not cool. Okay. Bobby! So, we will try and follow Bobby. Bobby will show us the way. <laughs> I don't think there's another shark who will clash with Bobby, so I think it's uh, safe to assume that if you f if you follow Bobby, um, you're pretty much gonna be safe. <laughs> oh yeah, this is your first time to see this, Guibas. Uh we did this, uh, I think, two streams ago. It was fun. Espen has been helping us, you know, find good stuff. <laughs> Even with the techniques of some of the spells. Oz is already here. Oz, hello? We cannot hear you, Oz. Hello? Sorry about that. Okay. I am so sorry about that. I'm following Bobby, Oz. I know. Hello. Oh. Ow! I got stuck in the tail. Whoa! Hold on. That thing attacked Bobby? Was it you or I didn't get damage? How about you? I got damage. Oh, it was you. Okay, shit. I thought it attacked Bobby. Where is Bobby going? I wonder. Hold on. Come here, us. Let's follow. Let's follow Bobby. I think it's going to the altar directly. Don't swim up because the mag is around here. Uh, there's one coming. Uh, yeah, that one is smiling. There's one to the uh, right. Bobby stopped. I think Bobby is teaching us where the stormhold thingy was or is still. Yeah. So that's the first. <gasps> down, oh, down, 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 down. The Meg's here. That's a huge one. Ooh. You wanna take a. You wanna take a bite? What? <laughs> no. No, I think the Meg's damage is the same as the Mosa. So you should be good. Bobby is going somewhere really weird. He's turning now. I think he's going to his sanctuary. I think. If you will follow. Are, are we still following him? No, I'm just going here. Come here. Let's go to the uh, altar. Not the altar, sorry. Shrine. Not to confuse, we always use the right term when referring to stuff. For example, the thing that you need to attune and ascend, we call it the shrine. And the one that you build um, at home is the altar. So, you know, just proper Owl. reference. There we go. Someone got poked. Right. Well, the last thing that we need to check is what changed in the underworld. We can check those once we, we are already fighting the... Uh, that's new. There's like a platform on top. Oh. See that? Yeah, and how are you going to go up there? I don't think so. You can't even climb this. Maybe that's something in the future. There are more mysteries in the cavern. You don't say. You don't say, Espen. 
while it's all out there for us to know, for us to learn, what are these things? I know why I have those in my inventory. I told you, remember when you get bugged when your inventory looks empty, but actually it's not? When you remember when you were building stuff? Yeah. Explore all secret locations you know of. Okay. Let's try and check the stormhold. I know that the stormhold sub-faction quest just around here. So let's see. Spike. <laughs> Spike my ass. <laughs> The mysteries of the cavern. Oh, we forgot the third cavern. We forgot to go up and check the ICU. I see you. I might go back there and check it. Okay, I think this is it for the Stormhold. There should be like a light. Where is the light? Yeah, where is the light? There's a light! What I know is it's not in the outer part. It's in the inner part. There. So it should be around here. Spikes. Press E to interact. What? Here, I found the box. Oh, what? The box. The box for the storm hole. I was really expecting that Espen placed something, you know, mamo here. So this is what you need to get. We will talk about this during our sub-faction walkthrough. All right. So this is another point of interest. Oh, I just realized. What? The memento is gone. Memento what? The memento and the Elvanor chests. Remember? Memento, the armor looking thing? Actually, it's still there. It's you found it? Yeah, I found it like when I was like roaming around yesterday. Oh, okay. I think. I'm gonna try and go back. Come here. Just come go me. back and check it. Yeah, come here. Just to make sure. Let's just use the right side of the the cavern. So that we will not get lost. Bobby might come back also, so he can help. Sharky. Hey. Secret locations, huh? That's Bobby. You found Bobby? Yeah, he just passed by. Oh shit, that thing's closing! I know. Uh, what? Where are we? Oh no. Ow! <laughs> No, I'm not. I'm not going there. I'm not going there. Are we going back? Yeah, I think. I think this is the way back. Yeah, this is it. I I can see the 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 bone. Where are you now? Um, the answer is I don't know. There are a lot of, you know, thingies like closing. Am I gonna die here? Oops. Uh. Where am I? Bruce is passing by. Hello? Staying here. I'm not going anywhere. Yeah, just stay there. Oh! I went back where the stormhold thingy is. 
Uh, the box should be there. Okay. Okay. Uh. Are you near the... Oh, okay, meet me where the water shrine is. Okay. I just hope there are no sharks. Uh, but well, there they're still there. <laughs> I don't like it. I know. I don't like this at all. Like, oh, even, oh. even though you have this comfort that you know, you will uh, not be one shot, right? The memento is here. Okay. For Elvanor. That's why I'm, I'm going back there. But... Ah! Hold on. But... Yeah, and also the armor is here. Okay, hold on. You are there where the... Yeah. Okay, I'm going back to you. The I'm secrets, just hiding now. The secrets of the underwater cavern. It's really an advantage once you have a water breathing already, but if you don't have... If you don't have the water magic yet... This is going to cost you your life once you're out of breathing potion. Okay. I think I'm almost there in your location. Ow. There we go. So they're still there? Yeah. Okay. So the Elvanor thing is still here. And then... And... The armor is there. The armor is still here. Okay, I'm going back. So, I see you. Or you can have the Riptide, correct? But Riptide is a random drop. You may you may or may not get it, so... Also. Um, there is a possibility that the shark will take a chunk out of me here. Okay, he's not around. It's not around. It's not around. It's not around. Yes. Okay, it's not around. For now. Ah! Oh! <laughs> Did not bite me the second time? Oh shush 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 shush. Okay. I I also got a jump from my. That is the same exact shark that bit me earlier. <laughs> I hate that shark. Okay, let's go to I see you. Come, 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 come. Oh, just behind you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hot Bobby's here. Don't worry, we're swimming up to see I see you. Uh -huh. This is another secret of the cave that oh, I know. I got bitten again. Okay, heal, 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 heal. Bobby. <laughs> Bobby, no. Don't Bobby, eat no. me. Hey, hey. <laughs> well, Bobby's not the one eating you. That's for sure. It's his pet shark. It's his pet. Who wants to kill you? Where are you now? Uh, I'm climbing. Don't worry. Just wait for me there. Find a safe place. I'm, I'm already up. Yeah. Okay. <gasps> ah! Uh. <laughs> this is another secret place. <laughs> Petrified. I see you. Very first time I experienced the I see you. I, I wouldn't lie. Almost shit myself. Because I was swimming towards, because Bobby Sanctuary before, like you can already see. 
um, from yeah. from the water. You just have to swim. The moment you get close enough, that girl Lisa is gonna show up, and then she's gonna say, "I see you," and then everything is very quiet before that. Crazy kid. Um. Okay. Let's try to bleed out and die. Geronimo! Almost. And that's why you never pass there. Um, the healing is not that powerful though. But it's healing nonetheless. There's another location you know in there. There's another location I know in here? <gasps> Where? Hold on. Um, is it the area where there was an alien that got trapped? I used to, like, I remember I went to that place where there's like, Lannis was there. Oh, you put something in there? Oh, okay. <laughs> now I'm intrigued. Okay, hold on, hold on. Just go back where the campfire is, and then I think the the cavern thingy is. So to start that the was a placeholder, huh? Okay, Espen, you are not saying anything. I think Espen was really like trying to withhold it, and like shit, I really want him to find it. <laughs> okay, I'm going there. I'm going there. I'm going there. Whatever you place in there, I'm ready for it. Or not ready for it. Okay. So, I stand corrected. The, the Memento and the Elvanor um, quest items are still here. Alright. Is this the right path, Oz? Uh, what? For what? Oh, yeah. It is, it is, it is, it is, it is. Hold on. What? We're going backwards. I know. No. We're not Wait. going backwards. We should be in the third cavern. Okay, then go. It's where the alien is, Oz. Just pull me if I get trapped. I got scared because <gasps> the shark is there. Stupid shark. <laughs> Like, <laughs> it's gonna make a sushi out of you. Sushi? Sushi. Like, shoo the sheep? Shoo the sheep. Um, who brought the food? I don't know. I thought you went out. No, I didn't. What the hell? I just checked. Maybe you should check where they placed the food. Okay. Hold on. Yeah, uh, just um, swim up. Uh, mm. Ah! <laughs> I know! <laughs> Backstroke, backstroke! Those <laughs> teeth, man. Okay, I'm just up here and wait. <sighs> okay, let's uh, regen and then climb up there. Oh, crikey. Okay. Reckless. Okay. Up, 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 up. Character's going crazy. No! Oh! Not like this! Ugh. Oh. Okay. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, Espen! You, I don't know if you're a genius or you, you just want people to get killed, which I love about you. I like watching people suffer as well. Oz is going to be thrilled with this. Woo! It's here. There's a guard though. <laughs> There's a guard though. Okay, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to surprise Oz. Hold on. 
I think she will. I think she will be happy with this one. Oh my goodness, we found it, boys. We found it. Woo! Okay, we found it. That's fun. That's really good. Um, I should kill this guy and jump. Uh, no, um, ignore the guy and jump. <laughs> um, I think I just killed the guy and jump. Oh, not the shark, not the shark. Oh. Yeah, this shark's route is always like that. And then it turns back. Good one. This is a very good location. Well, I wouldn't spoil it. <laughs> Only those um, watching or will watch the video will actually know this because I will not disclose this unless I'm already making guides. But for now, I know that Espen and the team, they're still going to make a lot of tweaks, not necessarily changes. Probably even changes in addition, so I'm not dropping any guides soon yet. So yeah. Once everything's in place, that's the time. Oz is taking time. Hey Oz! I found it! Hurry up! Now let's kill this guy. Let's kill it and then jump, making sure that there's no shark. Hopefully I don't die. I get four stacks, maybe I'm okay. But more than that, I think I'm gonna die. Okay, let's make sure that the shark is far away before we murder this thing. And we make sure we... Okay, I'm gonna use... Melee against this guy. I might be uh, stuck in... I might be stuck in a magic animation and that might cause my death. You see what I'm seeing, Oz? I don't. I did not see it yet, but Espen placed it here. <laughs> I I forgot about that place. Shit! What? <laughs> You're here. No, what I mean is when I was looking for it, I forgot to check out ah, this place. Because remember, es um, Espen is telling me today that I need to check everything that we already know about the place. So this is what he meant. Yeah. Ah, uh, no, man, why? What? I killed it so that we can do it safely. I was climbing up, you bitch. No, I'm getting played. Oh, no, I got six. I'm gonna die. I died. No. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> hey, where were you standing? You're not playing. Here at the back. You were too close. I was too close? Oh, ah yeah. man! Now I have to swim back. I will just pull you. No, 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 no! It's okay. Hold on. I'm good. I was not ready. <laughs> yeah, but you're the one who lived. You know what? I was not actually getting damage, and because she panicked and she was yelling, and you know, she you know won't. already what's gonna happen if she died. She's gonna be quiet. She's gonna be all mad. So that's why, yeah. <laughs> that's why I was the one who was panicking. I was already safe where I was standing. But because I worried looking for a place for her to stand, I died instead. Wow. Horrible life I have to have. So, it, so it's my fault now, yeah, It's huh? your fault. Well, it's better that I die, though. At least I will not be all quiet and mad. Shut up. Okay, hold on. This will be a fast swim. The cloud All right. Storm. At least, right? At least this is a proper walkthrough. Okay. Let this be the mark where I show you how to attune to deep connection. This is how you do it. It's in the underwater cavern. And it's in a place where no one has been before. 
Because we're all women. Our characters are all girls. So yeah. Hold on. What the? Hello? Hello what? I was- I lost my my breathing. My water breathing. <laughs> what the heck? What the hell? <laughs> Hello, Bruce! <laughs> hey. Okay, what? Why is there a big sound in the first cavern? Like a big, big sound. Uh -oh. Don't tell me the Saurus reached this part. Hello, well, Heimdall. Memnox, Hello, shut up. Love. Do not give ideas to Espen anymore. <laughs> <laughs> First Hello. cavern, you're already dead. <laughs> like, yeah, I tried underwater cavern. Like, yeah, um, how many... What section? Ah, First cavern. Something ate me. <laughs> Didn't go back. Don't mind. <laughs> More idea. I know. Remember the oh, things no. that remember the things that we were just joking around? I bet if I go to Harbinger's place, there should be like an additional thing in there in the water. Knowing Espen. The shark's belly is so shiny. I want to take a bite of it. Like I want to so... know what what is the skin care of the shark? Hey, they have have you touched a shark or not yet? And not yet. Like n n not necessarily white, you know, <laughs> the white. <gasps> I have it. I have it. <laughs> uh their skin is really tough us and then their scales their scales look like small arrows. Whoa. Mm. And it's so small that if you touch it, it's so rough. Um their scales their scales really designed for um aerodynamic and like it makes swimming less friction. That's why I, I have that's why seen sharks one, but you have seen it's one dead already. Yeah, no, it's, it's the same. You just, just touch it. No, it was like hanging like at the back of a bus. Uh, they but were I don't, I don't, I don't think the the scales will change in a way because they're dead or alive. It's just the same. Uh, um, their teeth is very interesting though. It's layers. It's like uh, it rolls. Like if if they lose teeth now, tomorrow it will just roll and grow new ones. I think there's like one thousand two hundred at a time. Razor sharp. So that's why, yeah, especially the the great white, deadly. <laughs> They're like perfectly evolved killing machine. Heimdall, why do you look like Bobby? Oh yeah, Heimdall looks like Bobby. Hundred <laughs> percent. That's our Let our our new puppy. Our new puppy looks like Bobby. Yes, he's st he's still growing here, so. It looks like he's losing here. <laughs> he's losing his baby fur and then changing, shedding it, and it becomes like hair later on. Oh no! What? <sighs> you died again? No, someone bit my ass. Heal up. Heal up. Heal up. Well, thank you, healing power. I'm coming! What? I'm coming! Oh, cooking. Ah! Someone's you turning! <laughs> hurry, hurry! I'm here. Someone's cooking here. Someone died here. Um, I think. Oh, um, Espen, I have a recommendation art here. There should be like <laughs> uh, a pirate six skeleton in front of this. You know, <laughs> he's what like the hell? <laughs> he's like he's trapped here and no one can help him. And maybe a an interesting item. Maybe he has like a treasure map. And he will uh, the, the note will say, "You want my treasure? I left it all in there. I left one piece. Go explore you, the world and be the next you, pirate king." Yay! You. <laughs> you know what? 
Yo. We should take a screenshot of this, put it in I Discord. Have been put it in Discord and then say, guess where it is. <laughs> okay. I've been looking I'm all over for you. Hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna take a screenshot. Okay, uh, I'll make sure I'll I will not capture the onyx because the onyx will give away the location. Okay, hold on. Uh, F12, yeah. There we go. And then I'll put it there and say, guess where it is. <laughs> I want to be like Espen too, <laughs> giving people a hard time. Oh, oh s'more! Ah! Check it out here! Check it out here! Into the cave! Into huh? the cave! Yeah. Oh, it's going to TP now. Oh my goodness! Let's get in there! Deep connection, baby! We are going to be teleported back to the Earth Altar. Go, go, go. By theory. Let's see. Whoa. Hello. What? Where the? What? Uh, so it's not always the case? Jungle? There's another one on. here. What's this? We are in the jungle. I know. Back to the jungle. What's what's on top? Uh, how about this? What's uh, that's, this? that's a new one. Oh, this is back. This is back. <laughs> Going back? Do you still remember like there's a platform? Um, like on top, like near the water shrine. Oh, that's it. Oh, sheesh. <laughs> hold, hold, hold on. Let me go back no, because I'm being attacked back. by a panther. Why am I? Why? Hold on. Is there is there a deep connection on the platform or no? There's none. Okay, I'm not going back. <laughs> <laughs> So you need to swim back. Oh, I will just go to Bobby. Yeah, I think you just go to Bobby. All right. <laughs> so that that thing teleported me here. What's here? I used to come here before. The question is, where is? Mm -hmm. Hello. Hello. Anybody? <laughs> I am actually near the Shadirian. Oh, no, not Silver Coven. Oh, uh, shark, what the like fudge? Panthers. Um, Obelisk Atune. So, therefore, you can look at deep connection as tunnels under the ground. Oh, there, yes. makes sense. And that's so it's why it's not just designated to one place. Yeah, that's why it's tied to earth magic in the feats because it's basically utilizing earth magic. So the 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 rationale or the magic behind the spell is that you're utilizing the earth as channels to transport yourself from uh -huh. one place to another. That's smart. It's like ants. <laughs> so now That's really good. I am in a vanilla area where I'm so OP. I'm not gonna fight these guys. I'm gonna get my stuff. Not my stuff, my boys. Hold on. Right here. I'm gonna wait for you in the entrance, Oz. Curiosity really. All right, there we go. The cat. So, in terms of magic, there's only one more that we didn't figure out. And trust me, we will. Oz will. Thank you, Espen. Espen. <laughs> Espen was like, <laughs> Espen did really, really cannot hold it, you know, giving hints. The very first hint that she gave, uh, that he gave us was, you already knew the place. Like, go to the places you knew. So when he told me, when he told me the thing, one more thing, there's only one thing I can think of, and that is the the hole that I got trapped in, <laughs> with uh, with the dude. So that being said, that dude cannot go inside actually. He can he will be trapped. So <clears throat> I think you don't have to kill it. You just have to interact with uh, the stone, the the crystal. Interact with the crystal. There's no pop-up that would prevent you from running. And then just go inside the hole and, you know, use the 
Use the deep connection. By the way, you should go down into the underpass where the Felgarth and Elvanor questline starts. Though, move cautiously. Oh, yes. Did you put something in there? Actually, um, the Did you Elvanor, already do this? The Elvanor and, I mean, like, it's the, the small camp or, like, the small... No, 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 no. The underpass, Oz. Well. Remember it, where it starts? Yeah. What I'm thinking where is Melandra where is? Melandra and Brulix are. Yeah. Wait, what about it? Did you already... They're not there anymore. They're not I there don't anymore? know. Yeah. So... But you can check it out, Coco. No, it says... Because Espen is not talking about... He's not phrasing his statement in past tense. It's It's present tense. Listen to this. You should go down into the underpass where Felgarth and Elvanor questline starts. Started was no. It where it starts. Did you already start your Elvanor or uh, Felgarth? Yeah. He wants us I to did. find something in there. He said, though, move cautiously. Okay. So maybe we can check in that during our faction faction quest. But I wanna try it. I cannot wait. Yeah. Okay, hold on. Cool. Let me bring my boys. Get your. your I already Felgarth. got my. Yeah, uh, I will get my Felgarth. Hold on. Hey, Tesla, are you following? All right. So I need to TP to. Faction Hall. Faction Hall. The admin hub is still here. <laughs> the old one. Still there. Heimdall is reaching my foot. What are you doing? You're swimming in the air. Oh, huh? Okay, it's gone. What the? All right, let's go. Elven. It, this um, way. I want to go Elvenor first. Well, their play, their starting point is the same. Okay. So. I'm also Elvenor. I think, so. Yeah, I already, I already learned Elvenor because of the magic. So I can, I can go in. Okay, here we go. Contractor, yes, the same. I think it's down. Ow. Ah. I think it's down. What the hell, Zeus? Zeus is body blocking me. <laughs> There should be a regular dude and a regular dudette <laughs> that I can talk to somewhere. Dude, dude, and dudette. <laughs> yes. Where were those dudettes? Dudes and dudettes. Dudette. Um, you said it already started, Oz. Can you just lead me to it? It seems like something changed here. Yeah, hold on. I think this is the one going under. This is it. Oh, yeah, this is it. This is it. Here. Yeah. These are the dudettes that I was looking for. Um, Elvanor. So I'm going to go with Elvanor. And I can already start the faction quest. Um, could I do this? No, I don't need to take it. I, we will do faction quest, so I will not start yet. But I think I can already enter. It's here, right? Straight. Straight? Okay. Here. Brulix and Melander are still here. Yeah. So, uh, he wants us to check something here. Hold on. <laughs> you go first because I already know what's in there. You guys are bullying me. Hold on. <laughs> I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> hey! I can already sense it! 
Why are there clouds here? Lisa is there. And she's walking. Yeah, she's following me. Move cautiously, Espen said. She's walking. She's okay, walking this towards is, me. This is already the exit going to the outdoors. Yep, it is. Okay, we're going back. Oh my god, why does it sound like... The grudge. I know, right? It sounds like the grudge is it. Uh, That's why I backed out. And there's like black clouds also. There's like. Oh, it's so creepy. Ah. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, oh no, I can see her. Hey, would it be funny if I scare her? Instead, she's scaring me. Because she's walking so creepy. Yo! Peekaboo! Ah, <laughs> you got petrified. No, I did not. I did? Yeah, you are. It's... I can see you. You're... It's weird. Your animation is like the... Um, the blood magic. Oh! Oh! He disappeared. She disappeared. Okay, let's see if... This is, this is what I'm trying to say, ma'am. Before, there were like small Eleanor... Yeah, like, this is the quest here. where you, you need to find people. Yeah, but this... they're not here anymore. That was it? God damn it. You, like the sound and everything. Uh... Oh yeah, they try... Ah, uh, I don't like the sound. <laughs> so, <laughs> like, you uh... mean to say that quest is still there, but it's no longer here. Uh, that reminds me of that freaking movie. The grudge. The grudge. Yeah, I really hated that movie. Um, Espen, whose idea is Lisa? I bet it's yours. <laughs> Espen has a very good sense of humor. And scaring, the? you know, scaring the shit. Oh, there we go. He said mine. Scaring the shit out of you <laughs> is, is his thing. <laughs> And she's there again. <laughs> oh, she keeps looping, I think. Hold on. You said blue um you mentioned earlier Brulix and Miranda are no longer here, or did I mishear mis misheard you? No, mishear I'm not you. saying Brulix and Melandra. I'm saying the camp is no longer there. Mm, the, the camp quest says find a small group of people. Yeah. It's actually an Easter egg for something upcoming. Oh no. Ooh. <laughs> He's adding more. There you go. <laughs> oh my God, I'm really gonna have a heart attack. Oh. Okay, god damn it, that's spent. That's really good though. That is really good. Alright. So we were able to learn the secret spells now or secret magic. That's Yay! really cool. Yay! So we're gonna oh post that God. video. We're gonna post that photo as a teaser. So it will be Wait. uh it will be a need to know basis. <laughs> they will Man. know if they will ask. Yeah, what up? I really wanna know what's the story behind Lisa. Because what? remember Lisa was also in in, in the, one of the in, cages. In, in the manor. Yeah. Uh, let's ask Espen. Espen, is there already a lore for Lisa or are you still working on that? What happened to her? Like, who is she and how did she come to being? And also, what intrigued us more is when you you go to you go to the um, the Anaris Manor. She is in one of the cages, and that's how we knew she's Lisa, right? Because yeah. she wrote it on the wall. Or probably she's not Lisa. Probably the one who murdered her is Lisa. Who the hell is Lisa? Lisa. Okay. The let me just was. let me just confirm something. Because we are about to embark on a wonderful journey of dying. Well, there will be deaths. Regardless how many times I have finished this mod. I still have debt, especially. I like face first gaming. Good. Okay. 
I just want to know if these um, quests have prerequisites. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna take them now. There is a whole lot of lore about Lisa, but her significance in AOC is an Easter egg. But when she is tied, what is she is tied? What she's tied to? You will learn about moving forward. Oh, oh. <laughs> I like that. So yeah, there is a lore about Lisa. Oz. I think you just need to read more, yeah, and yeah. you will know. Okay, so let's see. Aluri. This is the very first thing I want to do. Oh, sorry. Not Aluri. Nikada. Nikada will be my first victim. So yeah, there's no prerequisite. So I'm just going to take oh. all of these. You're taking the quests yeah. already? I'm, ge I'm getting the yeah. quests. Yeah, you take the quests. Fury. Just support you. Actually, this is just owner token. I, it's just... This is just for me to take, you know. Um, yeah. To take as a check mark. Who's next? Yep. And then next to Aluri, I would go with Eliza Cole. After Eliza Cole, I would go with Mama Bear. After Mama Bear, I will go with losing Thralls and probably getting killed multiple times. Gathen, Bloodfist. And then my last one will be, of course. Also, getting wrecked and probably getting killed. Harbinger of Souls Underworld. Alright. Hold on, let me just go wee wee. Cutie pie, the cutie pie, the cutie pie. Oh, G, I'm back. Okay, um, our first victim will be Nikada. Nikada. Yuri. Okay. All right, these will be my companions. Um, the magic I will be using will be switching between divine and um, blood, but I will have the the air magic in my inventory all the time just in case we need to escape. The buff I will be using um, for food will be um, hmm. I think I should give my followers more. So I think I have to use another food for that. I forgot. Was it? Was it cookie? Or was it potato? Potato. Potato is strength, weapon, damage. Hello there, oh, hottie. Oh, potato and sourdough is the same. Um. What are you doing? Who are you talking to? I'm talking to the hottie. That is, you know. <laughs> Walking down the aisle. Alright, um, Oz, um, oh, I have okay. a black hole, so that's okay. I'm good. Okay. Um, uh, by the way, black hole is very freaking expensive, so basically, 
the the dungeons or the raid bosses this will be um this will be like where you spend everything that you have already um looted or you have crime did you check the chain ah aloran let's go out forgot forgot about it thank you for reminding me aspen so we will check um aloran and the outskirts as well Now that Espen is saying that, it seems that he left something in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. definitely he left something in there. Hold on. Just drink water. The food is actually in the microwave, man. Ah, okay, good. I thought they placed it outside. Only Bruno will eat that. The hell? He actually made a mess. That's why it took me like quite a while before Bruno? I went back. Huh? Bruno made a miss? No, like, you know, the food that I left outside for them. And like, there's like a lot of mess. Bruno and... What's the name of the other the other one? <laughs> I don't know. What's the name <laughs> of the other one? Alright, let's see. So we have some tornado in Aluran. Uh, been riding that tornado yesterday. The dragon... Yeah. The dragon seems to appear out of nowhere sometimes. Let's try and ride it. So yeah, I can... I would say I can use it to escape if I want to. Make sure you have your air magic though or else... You're gonna go splat. Alright. I know what's in there. Uh, this is where you can... Uh, I think this was already present in the previous patch. Remember the Ilarican pool us? Yeah. There we go. Um, Espen, did you put monsters in here or just the crazy people, you know? What the heck is that? Huh? Was that you? Yeah. Don't scare me like that. So we have the Ilarican pool here. There are some crazy people throwing stuff at you. Yeah. And when they die, they produce Ilarican plague. But this was so be careful. This was this is not October 2023 new. I think this was July 2023 or December 2022. Um, update actually. Um, just be careful because there are like the scourge hounds as well. Oh, there are. Okay, I'm out. Yeah. Let's go to. Um, let's go to where the Van Gools are. I think that's where Aspen probably plays something. Easter egg. Just let me know, Aspen, if you want me to check something or get killed by something. <laughs> <laughs> I will just spawn in the faction hall anyway. Hey, they're ignoring us. Okay, shit. <laughs> Is that overcharge? No. That's just air magic. Whoop. Oh no! I'm not going down! Sometimes you do that while you have air magic. Hey, you almost... <laughs> I heard... I heard you broke your knees. Really? I did not. Because I have my air magic. I know, but the I heard hell? it. Hey, don't, 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 don't. Bombay's there. Oh, Bombay. Yeah. Bombay badunk What is this? Eff effigy doll. What is this? This is a treasure. Just head where the spectral wraith is. Okay, on it. See, I told you it's where the... Oh, sheesh. What? See that? That's a dragoon. I know, I visited here yesterday, but yeah, I want that, you to that discover that dragoon it. attacks. Sheesh! I want you to discover it and you will see what I mean. La 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 la. Magic wands? You mean staves? Um, I'm not sure. I'm not a fan of staves. 
So it may not be my priority. Actually, to tell you honestly, using stabs is not really as much powerful as using the actual magic, you know, magic weapon. The only advantage of stabs is that some of the stabs can support multiple magic. However, their ultimate is still going to be the original element. Um, probably it looks more amazing if you're holding it. So yeah, I always find... Hey, some... Someone's fighting there. Um, soul magic will be achieved after we finish the game. Like, we finish the final dungeon. So, yeah, we will definitely do soul magic. The reason why I am collecting the relics. The staff of Harbinger is very good. What element is it? What element is staff of Harbinger? Every staff has a has a base element. Probably it's the soul, man. Um, I would go with blood, I think, if I can remember. But yeah, it has its own element. <clears throat> All you need to do is compare the damage using the magic weapon and the staff, and you should be able to to tell giving the actual numbers. I can already hear them up there. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, do you wanna Here. no let's not do ah uh, we have to do this do you have ah uh, no you yeah. don't have your voice yeah do you want me to get them oh yeah get them i'll wait for you here okay i will just tp going home mm -hmm. It's soul magic, so when you do the ultimate, it's still going to be soul magic. How different is the damage? Can you give me numbers? <clears throat> um, I can start clearing. Hold on. I think I got... I think I already got the mission from this guy before. Oh yeah, I already got it. The first time I came here for blood magic. <laughs> okay, I need to make sure that my boys have food. And I need to make sure that they are buffed. <coughs> um, two buffs. And stack. Oz, can you go to can you go to the vault? Yeah. I have uh, you know, the the elixir that has a fist strength elixir i cannot i cannot open it i cannot open the vault 1k for each hit uh, is that for the air magic or the soul magic <clears throat> 1k for each hit The soul. Hmm, we will try that later. Because the last thing, the last time you told me also that fire magic was uh, more powerful than blood is it's not the case. Fire magic is still weaker than blood. So there might have been some tweaks along the way. So I think it's better that we test it once we have it. We can always spawn the stabs. Uh, ma'am? Mm -hmm. I cannot open your vault. The big vault? Yeah, I can't. Why? Oh shit, It says container is locked. No, 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 no. It's your, it's your rank. <laughs> I forgot. Hold on. Uh, promote. You just got promoted. Shut you up. just got promoted. There, there we I can go. open it now. <laughs> What do you want me to look for in here? Uh, the elixir, the elixir. Oh shit, who's attacking us? Hey, how this? What the? What? Uh, the elixir with the fist. Okay, there's like two here, so is that all? Yeah. Um, for some reason, there's a. There's an Azahirian here, us. 
Yeah. He, he went down. <laughs> We're not yet even Probably. up. What the heck? Probably it's patrolling. I don't know. Patrolling my ass. Hey, what are you patrolling here for, sir? Oh, he got num num staff. Staff stuff. Staff. Num 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 num. Um, good. Sir. Okay. I was just, just waiting. Be going um, there. so here's what's gonna happen. Since we're already here anyway, and we need the head of Harbinger. We need the head of Harbinger so that we can legit use the altar for Harbinger. And also to show um how to safely, you know, kill Harbinger. It's basically the same uh, as what I did with the blood. Why magic. am I here? What? Like I TP'd up there. What the fudge? Where are you? Hey, I see you. Yeah, I TP'd like <laughs> really near the blue guys. What the hell? Hey, you aggroed them. I did. Oh, oh no, you didn't. I thought someone's chasing you. Okay, um, Tesla should be left somewhere and then let's put a bedroll here, us near the gate. I'm not sure if we can really build here, but... No, not build. I, I was able to place I, it. You were okay. Before, yeah. Alright. You seem to have forgotten when this place was still a straight shot. Remember that? We yeah. placed the bedrolls here. Always. It has been. I have forgotten a lot of stuff. Just don't go there. There's a there's an Espen rabbit in there. I will <laughs> call the rabbits from now on Espen. Espen? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Espen, like, I think there's a rabbit there, and there's also there where the... Uh, usually, it's a crocodile or a snake. It's oh, good thing there's a swirly swirly in there, Oz. Here, <laughs> mom. I'm dropping the... The... Elixir. Yeah. Take well, it. at least I'm glad the bombie does not explode on its own. You have to attack it. But the... The rabbit, though... It will explode. <laughs> The moment it gets near, especially if your graphics is not that good, oh my god. You're gonna suffer the consequences. I just hope my guys will not die immediately. <sighs> uh, let's hope. No, let me tank. Okay. Always follow that. You break that, they, they're dead. Because their HP is not that awesome. It's, it's balanced. They, they're painful, but they have to be squishy. But my boys at least can tank. And there's an Alarican thing in there, so be careful. When I say back, you have to go back. Yeah. You're, you're basically support, and it doesn't matter if me and my boys are dead. This is the same exact routine that we always do. I tank and my boys. If you see me die, you run. Ah, you see me die oh. and you cannot handle it anymore, you run. And we reset. That's it. That's how okay. it's always been done. Ever since. Hold on. Let me just uh, make sure I feed my boys proper food. Okay. Two bups. It's good. Okay. Um, <laughs> let's make sure that I can that monitor breeding, you. Though. I can monitor you. There we go. Can I monitor this too as well? Yes, I can. Uh, did you not give them, like, agility? I have Elixir agility at home. Uh. Nah, that's okay. But you should. I'm not, like, you know, taking this really seriously for Oh, now. that's okay. I think we can. Yeah. Okay, because let's go. I know that we are going to, like, we'll do just the run. real thing. This is the real thing now with Harbinger. Okay. So that's okay. Hold on, let me just... Is it Essence of Evil? Is it? Wait. I'm not liking this at all. I'm so scared of that guy. Why? <laughs> Essence of Rage. Ah, yeah. This is it. Okay. Um. Well, I need to remove that for now. Because that's gonna block my view. There. So we're doing Essence of Evil now. Follower party functioning. 
Um, cool. I tank. You support with, uh, you know, you support with... Are you with... not leaving Tesla behind, Ben? Hold on, where is... I thought I did. What the heck? Tesla's still following you. Oh, this is going to be another Tesla death. Yeah, Tesla <laughs> should really not follow all the time. <laughs> you picked the wrong fight. Someone is like always fighting. Eternal fight between the Van Ghouls and the Stormhold. Started all this, you know, conundrum. There we go. Don't die. Well, that's not aggro until, you know, attack, so that's cool. Alright, I have my blood, I have my divine, but mostly we will be using divine. Um, We're gonna do... Pull the enemy. We will not, we will not use the exploit in the water. We will play it as it is intended. Okay, let's go. careful there's a dragon so yeah oh there's a big ass soul stone i know <laughs> what did you do i hope that's it oh no there's something on the roof as if the as if the rates are not enough to make your life hell here um, Oz, let's kill the ones at the oh, back. Oh, no, no, there's a black... Oz, let's kill... Man! Let's kill the... It's... Let's... Oh, you're not... Oh, you're... It's, it aggroes, I'm sorry. That's okay. I was saying let's kill the ones at the back. So that they okay. will not join the fight. My boys okay. can handle this. We'll do it. We'll do, you know. We'll do mano, imano, a mano, bimano. My boys heal faster if I fight with them. So that's why I have to. And I see what you did. What you did here, Espen. It's no longer the swirly, swirly. It's a heart. Okay, let's go here. Let's kill these guys first. Your boys can join. Let's see if they can handle it. Us here. There are two here. Make them attack. Let's see if uh, they can handle it with their squishiness. The hell? Yeah, I know. We'll 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 help if ever. Oh, uh, that's a bread one. That's okay. That's okay. At least they, we will know if they can handle it or not, so that we will bread know our strategy. Blue. Yeah. Just make them, you know, fight it. Not you. Okay. Let's see. They're so strong, us. They're gonna melt those two. Trust me. Okay. Good. See that? One is attacking auto uh, auto attack. Look. They're not ulting. They're just right clicking. Hold on. They're like stacked in for the bleed. Hold on, hold on. That's okay. They're doing right clicks. They're not doing Oh shit, the dragon us. Woo! -hoo -hoo -hoo! Good thing it didn't see us. Hey, you helped! They didn't do right click. They uh, they didn't do um, sp uh, ultimate. They were just using right clicks. But they were using the retribution, which is good. I think I'm happy with that already. Oh, Espen, what did you do to the ward? How is real estate becoming a problem in AOC? Why? <laughs> Why are we saving real estate here? As <laughs> I think Espen so like, okay, that's a little broken. <laughs> now that he knows the ward, <laughs> let's make it smaller. <laughs> let's make them smaller. <laughs> All right. Well, uh, we will make them fight in the middle. Sneaky Espen. Okay, let's do it. They can handle it. Just, you know, use the heal us as... Kind of like reasonable usage. I know that we just spawned it, but I need you to use it reasonably. Because yeah. in an actual game, that thing is very expensive to make. I and know. we will just use the heal when we are really in dire need of heal, not overusing it. Because we can handle. Okay. We can handle. Let's try and aggro the gargoyle on the top. Is that thing alive? 
It looks alive to me. <laughs> it's moving. Hold on. Let's kill the Azaherians first. It's huge. I'm spinning his ideas. Okay, this one is blood magic. It's not aggroing yet. CFI's underscore 29 just fall. CFYZ, thank you so much for the follow. Hello, welcome to the stream. Alright. Okay, let's try shooting this guy. Oh shit. If that thing attacks like the, you know, the underworld, it should it should be able to one-shot us. What the? Yeah, it's there on top. Uh, dragon. Yeah, just don't make it see you. It's freaking me out. Uh, that thing is breathing. I'm 100%. Oh. Hello? I I bet Espen is giggling right now. Hello? Hello? I don't think it. Espen, this thing is ugly. <laughs> and scary. What's your plan with this one? I believe you have a plan with this one. Oh, definitely. I don't think you will put something in there without a plan. I think you, you're you still coding this one. I have a feeling that's what you're doing. But that one, the one flying, I think is already ready. Oh, that thing is really breathing. I'm sure. Let me just climb. Hold on. I will you die. You are really bad at it. <laughs> it's up to you. <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to poke its butt. Oh, you cannot climb. Okay. So, yeah, it's uh we're going to wait until that aggro's. Maybe on the next patch. <laughs> why? Uh, why would there is you wait? one. Oh! Huh? Oh, look at the water. What? Oh. The water is red? <laughs> oh, it's red tide. <laughs> Okay, that's good. Damn it, I shouldn't have shown you the water, Espen. Hey. You aggroed somebody, man. Oh. I have higher damage for um as a Hyrianos. It's not only 70. Hey, what did you do? Uh, the my slam. earth magic. Uh, did it earth work? magic. There. I'm They're trying. already casting ultimate. Oh, you're poisoning them? Yeah. I think I'm also being poisoned. Are you poisoning me? What the hell? Hold on. Um, or maybe I'm hungry? Alright, um, let's aggro... The ones on the left and the right. Okay, hold on. There we go. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna get more. I don't see the hound. Ah, it's there. It's in the house. I'll aggro this one. Ooh. I did not hit it. Hold on. That's good. Espen really nerfed the, the black hole. <laughs> this is gonna be fun. There oh, we go. Yeah, it so it's no longer swirly swirly, it's a heart icon. Remember the, the heart icon from a dancer before us, like the weapon? It's the same yeah. as that. Don't worry about healing me. I can heal myself. I will just tell you if I'm out of heals. I'm just cleansing. 
Oh, cleansing is good. Because of that smoke thing. Okay, we don't have to kill those guys by the green tornado. Let's go. Um, I'm Wait. wondering what will happen if you go to the water. Hold on, let me try. There are red and peeps there. The I swirl is bane of the accursed. The heart is the curse of true God. Oh! Okay. Ah! It doesn't do anything, but you cannot see it. There's no vision. It didn't add any poison or whatever. But at least you're blinded where you're going. At least. Uh, this is the background music that Oz really likes. Yeah. The Harbinger. It's really giving me the Witcher vibe. Hold on. Don't don't come to me yet, okay? Don't come to me yet. Because I don't know if the... Your boys are here. It's dangerous. I know. Because I don't know if the... If the... Hold on. What? Because there is an Ilarican Plague Hound. So, pulled him back. Okay, good. Shit. Did it attack? That sound nope. is an attack. I did not get my HP nip. I don't know. Okay, good. My boys are fine. I think that thing can one shot, if I remember. Probably, yeah. Okay, um, I'm hunting for the dog so that we can go all out from here. I think if I aggro this one, the dog is going to aggro as well. Okay. Yeah, Hunt you go first then. Boy. I'm just gonna stay at the back. Okay, hit him. Or I can probably him have them kill the red and blue eyes. No, 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 no. At the back? Yeah. Yeah, at the back, go. Where the tornado is. Oh, Jongi, how's your vanilla, you know? How's your vanilla set up so that I can join? Let's do this. <laughs> they want to play vanilla. Probably just watch them, you know, play with the bosses. Okay. All right. Uh, for some reason, the hound did not come out of the house. I think it's still waiting for the gargoyle to take action. Okay, gargoyle time. I think the boys will be useless against the gargoyle. If the gargoyle does not come down. Holy shit! Hey, Gargi! What you doing? Hold on, what is this? Can I hide here? Yo! <laughs> the gargoyle's cheating. He's not coming down. Oh no! He got oh! He got good damage. He got good damage. I repeat, he got good damage. Do you need me to heal? Uh yeah. Shoot him. Die, you gargoyle, die! Oh! Uh they are! Um, oh, this is weird. I spent luck. Maybe you want to check this out. The HP bar of the gargoyle is right here. The boys are actually able to reach. Oh. Did you die? Hold on. Oh my god, what was that? Heal, 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 heal. Oh, oh this thing is tanky, doo doo. Well, it's a mini boss. I haven't found a way to move the HP bar yet. Got it. But at least there's an HP bar. I thought there wasn't. Mm. 
The boys are holding. Yeah, and it's painful. Yes. Oh my god! Can you imagine if this size of the gargoyle can do this much damage and tankiness? How much more the big boy? The one that Esmond did not activate yet. <laughs> Crazy. Alright, Holmes there. Um, This thing does not stack up, you know, the, the undead debuff though. So I think blood magic would have worked properly. What is this? Uncut diamond, onyx, and honor chest. Good, 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 good. Um, let's go. Oh, the hound is here, Oz. Back away. Okay. Archers are your friend when dealing with those. True. It's me. I think. I think it's more of a physical damage for that one. So yeah, the the boys were not really dealing much damage because they're melee. Um, we will handle this. That's okay. I'll tell you when it's clear. Talk. Talking to the boys, AC and Ken are good with it. Go! Make it! Make it! Make it! At least you guys would also learn vanilla. I think it's good. You start off with that. At least you will have fun. Espen, these things were not here before. Decoration or will be used someday? It looks like a spawner, to be honest. I think you have plans for that. We'll need your help setting up. Yeah, no problem. It's vanilla. It's easy to set up. Okay, I'll ask him here. We have um, Servants of Zaina. We'll see. Ah, so it has plans for that. Okay, this thing is painful. So careful. Look at what, you know, the divine magic does with that one. Oh, he got the swirly! He got the swirly! Yay! Uh, yeah, I know, right? Got obliterated. Yeah. What? With divine magic, baby, against the undead. And that's two buffs, uh, debuffs. The swirly and the heart. What's the, what's the official name? Sorry. The swirly is the bane of, bane of the cursed, bane of the cursed, and then cursed of the gun. There we go. You can still use the water, but it's hard to navigate. I think Espen really had to do something about it because when I used it before, when we went blood magic, it was not aggroing anyone. Okay, so this is where we died last time. A lot, ma'am. Uh, we underestimated, yeah, we underestimated the, the boys. Yeah, and we went, there. we went here right away and it aggroed... Um, it, I, it aggroed Harvey right away, so we have to make sure that we pull them, we kill... Kill the gargoyle. No, not the gargoyle um, for now. We kill Zaina. Once we kill Zaina, we're good to go in. Okay. Okay. Um, I'm gonna target the red. Do you have a bow? I have a bow, but I don't uh, have arrows. I have a bow. <laughs> uh, I, I think we can target easily if we use a bow. You have an arrow? Yeah, I got five black eyes arrow. Oh, uh, give me. Okay. I take this and this. No, no, no. Just, uh, just the arrow. Oh. Nice bow, though. Let's use AOC bow. The dragon flying. Is that a boss? Uh, it's the pet of the boss. <laughs> Okay, I'll get the red one. Zaina will definitely come to the rescue. Oh, sheesh! Yeah, it's a pet. You don't have to fight it, you just have to kill the boss. Oh, this guy is smart! 
There, see? If we went there, Harby will be with these guys. Okay, us. We have two. No. I'll go this side. Huh? No. What? Hey, go, 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 go. Oh, I'm dead. That's okay, that's okay. That's okay, that's okay. Ah, I know. It's the dragon. The dragon saw me, man. You died? Almost. Okay. I thought I will die. Good thing I didn't have the, the death grip. Or maybe this time I will die. Do you have the dome? Get in the dome. Yeah, it's okay, it's okay. I'm chilling. I'm just trying to dodge this guy because he's an ass. I have the gargoyle with me. That's okay. Zaina is with me. He's having fun. Okay. <laughs> good thing, good thing you realize it looks like Nasus. I, I call that thing Nasus all the time. So the craziest thing is that my main character in League of Legends is trying to kill me in this game. So that's what it is. Alright, we're coming to you, us. How many gargoyles are you fighting? I got one. Okay. Um, I think this guy needs... Um, this one. Right here. Okay, it bleeds, it bleeds! If it bleeds, it will die. If it bleeds, I will use Arcane. Uh, Renick. Uh, Renick, his brother? Renick is probably the meta, but Nasus, regardless, oh, shit, of, I regardless the of the meta, Nasus would always be my main character. That's why I bought all the skins for Nasus and all the skins for Crocky. Renick, because they're my boys. All right. So yeah, um, I think using divine magic against this, that guy will take a long time. So yeah. well, gargoyle is not undead, so basically it's living. That would make more sense. Okay, let's make sure that Harby does not have any strong companion. companion. <laughs> um, if if there's still another red or Zaina, we have to kill it first. Yeah. Hold on. So we aggro, um, we aggro Harby, we aggro everyone. Sheesh! Dragon. That dragon hurts. Us. <gasps> what? Hey, it's not a specter. I told you yesterday you were not listening to I me. did not listen, no. I did not hear. Oh my god, this is not a spec- Ow! Shit, 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 shit. Do not attack, do not attack, do not- He got- Ow! <laughs> do not save daddy. Let, let him come to us. <laughs> They're- Design uh, their program to protect me. Shit. Okay. Now I'm taking damage. They will definitely attack. Did we get more aggro? You could actually make them come. Hold That's on. Okay. Let me I'll, I'll kill this guy. I'll kill this guy. Let me ward you there. Because it, <laughs> they will not be able to hit you. Uh, the the purple. If you're inside the arcane, yeah. The purple thingy. Okay, I see two Azahirians. No, one Azahirian and servants. Can we kill them first? Right here. Come here with me. Uh, hold on. Let's stay here. They're not yet done. Oh, okay. What the? Okay, I will shoot. I will shoot the red one. Damn it, we have no ammo. Shoot them so that they will come near. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Oh, wait, hold on. Can you shoot them when you're inside the ward? Uh, am I inside the ward? Yeah. No, you I, cannot. I we already did that. No, no, you're not. No, it you're will not. be on your face. Oh, uh, I wasted my black hole. Why are you like hitting them with your black hole? You got your bow earlier. I have no arrow. Oh shit! I have explosive arrows, like six. Do you want that? No, 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 no. I got, I got one. I got one. Okay. Hit me with your best shot. The night shall rise. Yeah, the night shall rise and you will be dead. I'll get one more. Don't be cocky. <laughs> well, if it's it alone, it should not be a problem. This one this one is just chilling. Hey, the gargoyle is getting near. Yeah, the gar the gargoyle is aggroed. I repeat. It is aggroed. Okay. 
Did you like pull it? Yeah, I did. Not there. Because, uh, you know, me. you might... You Ow? might aggro. What pushed me? The, the gargoyle, man. You forgot about that? It hurts. I didn't know it has a knockback. Oh, he likes me. That's Will it hurt if I will try and poison it? Hold on. Go. Well, it's living, so you can stack poison, I can stack bleed. Yeah, there, it's poison. But no debuff from the divine magic. It's basically just raw damage for the divine magic. How about arcane? Um, yeah, arcane, good. Does Arcane oh. Sunder? We were trying to test that. I don't see Sunder though. No, I don't see Sunder either. I think it's the it's the I think Keldoras. It was the, yeah, I think it was the Kildoras. The spawn of Kildoras. Okay, this guy and Azahirian alone. So we fight. Hold on, is that? Oh, that's just a statue. <laughs> Harvey is actually just there. Shit, I thought. We're fighting the actual Harvey. It's not yet time for the underworld, baby. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, it's better to use a bow when you pull because this sometimes is really wonky. There's Whoa. like an Azahirian something Yeah, wonky doo-doo. Do. The Azahirian is like chilling. Like, I don't give a shit with you guys. <laughs> Shooting me in my face. How dare you, bro. Okay, enjoy the damage over time. Enjoy it. Woo. See, even though they're just, what? 6,000 at level 20? 6,000 at level 20. It's still fair because of how painful they are. Okay. I think it's time for Harby. It's just are you sure? it's just Harby and one Nasus. So what's the plan? What's the plan? Just wreck him. Okay, fine. He said so. Oh no! Two Azarians! Ah. Oh no, they're not they're 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 different! They're dancers! Okay. Uh, we're gonna focus on Harby us. We just focus on the others. My boys are with Harby. Whoa. I'm gonna kill this woman who's trying to kill you. Okay, this will be a clean run if we don't have deaths. <gasps> oh my god, I casted. Oh, thank god for the heal. Hey, remember, it can one-shot. Harby's ultimate. I know, I know. That's why I'm really far away Careful. then. Okay, now... Oh, 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 Okay, okay. How's the boys? How's the boys? We're good, we're good. They're, they're good, they're good. Okay. I am casting, and I might die because I am stationary. Oh my god, look at your el uh, your, your elders, Oz. You were so sad when you saw their numbers before. Look at them. As long as they're support, they should be fine. <gasps> no! Oh, oh, no! No, 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 no! I'm too close, I'm too close! Oh shit, I almost died. I almost died. I almost died. Uh, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. I will make them take care of it. Holy shit. Ooh, I hate that feeling. Oh, let me get your head, sir, and your diamond. Screw you. Let me get everything. We deserve this. Oh, uh, nah. By the way, chat, you can get tons of ectoplasm from this guy. Use your, you know, your best skinning knife. And you will get, I think, like 100 um, ectoplasm. So, should be good. Yeah, see? Statue. Hey! Oh. There's one dude left. Yeah, he did not aggro. What's wrong with him? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, shit. See? Oh, 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 oh! Uh, we aggroed something else.
Woman with a big bazonga? Yeah, that sounds really, you know, accurate. I was like... I was so amused when someone, like, in, in Discord, someone was asking, where can I get Black Lotus? It's where I can get Bitter Cranilla. And then someone, someone just nonchalantly, very normal, answered, you can go to, you know, um, the, the Temple of Harbinger. And this guy said, okay. And then, what happened? I don't know, maybe he came back and said, screw you, dude. Like, can you at least give me something or somewhere that's safer? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there are a lot. Of, uh, there are a lot here because this is a different. Oh shit, the dragon! Oh shit, the dragon! Hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna hide. You can always go to the, you know, the the witch queen's palace if you want an easier version of this. <laughs> advising someone to come here just to get these um zaina already spawned so i think we need to get going where where's the you just want to i just want to jump here you remember the broken bridge going to the uh... faction hall i don't want to go back and you know do the thingy we can just make them chains and then i think it's jump. here yeah you have your air magic ready just follow me yeah Oh no! We have to come back what? for Tesla. Let's just go back. Then let's just go back. Okay, I'm using my choo choo. Do you want to go faction hall straight after getting Tesla? Um. Do, do you still remember the green tornado? I think you forgot in the No, no, no! I will go to Grandpa to get the silver key. Ah. Remember? And that will be our key to the underworld. The moment we, we need to go on the already. Okay. Yeah, no one has spawned yet, so it's cool. Black Lotus in the jungle. Um, jungle with Harambi would be easier. Yeah, there are two locations, and um, if you are smart, you just go there and just wait for it to respawn. If you can defeat them, um, it will be a huge reward, aside from doing the was successfully and neatly um you can always just you know get them one time and then there should be a lot but if you go there for like farming purposes that wouldn't that wouldn't be worth it you're gonna spend a lot of resources all right servants in the underworld kill servants the, of wraith uh, the azurian yeah they chase already yeah see i told you Hold on. I want to see if they are more on auto attack. They are actually better. Look. They combine auto attack, right click, and ultimate, you know, um, alternately. They're not the same as before. That they seldom auto attack. And they often do ultimate. And barely seen doing right clicks. It's good. And they, they're not even buffed. How much more if they're buffed us? Well, you need to buff them though with the actual dungeons that we're gonna go. Okay. It's non it's it's non-negotiable. They need to be able to fight at their best to make sure that, you know. If they die, at least we say we we made sure that they were at their best. Rather than if they die, we will be like, ah, I should have, could have, something like that. So no regrets, at least. Uh so, um, additional content in the future. I believe the big gargoyle would play a big role in that location. Um, I think the, the stone piles would probably be like a spawner or something. Um, damn it, there's still more. I wouldn't be surprised like if there's a new patch in coming weeks. Hold on. Can I, can I get a, can I get a T9 please? Let's see, let's check. Hey, make sure they're on guard, okay? Yeah, they are. Oh! Hey! What? They, they lessen the number of the, the grunts here. Look, hey. they're, they're very few. That's a blacksmith. And that's a taskmaster. 
And the cowardly Rel Relvan. Uh, these are the spawn points here for T69. Nikada is an NPC, will not fight, but these dudes will fight at the back. For those who are looking for, um, what call them? Um, armored grunts. If you're brave, come here. There's a lot. There's a lot of them. By the gate. First entrance, and then there's still more here. I think there's a, um, there's a quest that will make you kill like ten of them. Yeah, this is where you can go. Just make sure you pull them properly. <laughs> Aryan and then she likes Tesla. Everyone loves Tesla. He is the mascot. Or she is the mascot. I just realized that Oz actually doesn't have... Um... A mount with her. Okay, so that's the head. We can already TP back home. How do we TP back home easily? Uh, I don't want to admin us. You just pull me, please. Pull me yeah, somewhere safe. On. The game has been okay. My map has been thoroughly destroyed by the admin TP, but at least that's the only problem I'm having so far. Okay, we're home. Are we? Oh yeah, we are. Okay, dokay. Hey, I only see one of your boys. Oh, I have two of them following oh, okay. me. Okay, now I see two. Oh my god. Let's wait. FPS drop near the... Hey! There's a guy chasing what? you! <laughs> he said you stole something. Oh, that's a wrong move. <laughs> oh, that's no. That's a wrong move, buddy! <laughs> <laughs> Did he just fight Death Knight? <laughs> that's a wrong move, Well, buddy. at least he didn't fight Shiva. What the heck? It was like, hey, you took my coin. What do you have in here anyway? Why is it so stuttery? What's your what's our threat level? Six. So we need to put more treasure? Yeah. How do we put more treasure though? Yeah, you can place uh gold coins or gold bars. Or the ones silver. that are, la are labeled treasure? Yeah. Okay, I gotcha. I'm gonna and placeables should be placed. I'm gonna make within that threat the level. radius. Something, something. Hold on. So we're going. Is there something you want to do, or can we already start at least getting the, you know, the low level dungeons? Uh, we can start. Okay. The building, I can, you know, like pause it for now, and I will just okay. probably continue it someday. Cool. All right, I want to have um I want hmm I want more action. So I want to go melee. Hold on. We need arrows for pulling. We cannot, you know. Um Oh, sheesh. Um, that. Um, all well, we're done with that. Keep those pets. A little power. Um, key will be used later. Okay. Uh, I will use the more damage on followers. Is it Tears of Gula? Hold on. Okay, there we go. Yeah, it's Tears of Gula. Uh, Tears of Gula will... Where the heck is that? Okay. This will increase... I am encumbered. God damn it! Okay, 
I don't need that. I need Tears of Gula. Cool. And I also need... Oh, man. What's making me heavy? These things don't have weight. <gasps> the Fire Frost is freaking heavy! Mm -hmm. okay. It is. If you have, like, a lot... Near okay, now I can move. It is. Um, I will get the damage. Oh, shit. Um, I need arrows. I think I still have. Do you still want me to bring the magic people? Or... Oh, yeah. Okay. So, basically, the relics are recommended after 80. So, you already know what you get after 80. Hold on. Hey! Uh, I will be right back, ma'am. I will just change my clothes. <laughs> I hate it when they hear the gate downstairs and then they still react even though it's not ours. Well, you cannot blame them because yeah, they think that it's their, this it's their place life. is ours. <laughs> Okay, so what am I planning here? Um, I want to do melee most of the time, so I'm just going to replace this with that. I will still keep these two. We're not going to be fighting undead most likely. Um, water magic could be good. I can help with the fire frost. Um, nah. So Nikada will be first. We don't need this. Okay, I will bring Fire Frost. Ah, I'll just use Fire Magic. It's a, It has a decent amount of damage. So Fire and Blood Magic. There we go. We're not going to use Black Hole for now. That's kind of... It's not necessary for this um, these um, dungeons yet. I will start probably using Black Hole against Gathen. And next will be um, Harbinger, the actual Ray. However, for all the bosses before that, I will probably just use regular magic and my melee weapon if I have the chance. Okay. Straw hat F. What? A straw hat? What is this? Luffy? Hello? Um, We're good, I think. Right. So, I gave them... I gave them follower damage plus 12%. They have their own buffs as well. I have my own strength weapon damage. I will add more by interacting with Orb of Blood. This will give me more strength. There we go. There we go. Um, Again, this is working 100% because I have fully ascended to blood magic. If you haven't fully ascended, it will be 50-50. If you haven't learned um, blood magic, it will 100% kill you. So yes, please be warned. Uh, we that this is the this was the first target of our video. So yeah, again, I will put timestamps. Don't worry later on. Um, Oz, I'm ready when you're ready. Yeah, hold on. Give me a sec. I think uh, aloe extract. Still have wraps. Need more. <sighs> Wraps is very important when you're experiencing bleed or any any negative effects that giving you that's giving you damage per tick. If you will if you will take your potion right away, <clears throat> it's not gonna heal you. It's you're still gonna bleed out continuously. So make sure that you have wraps to stop the bleed out. Or the damage over time. You do some cleansing probably before you drink your potion. Right. My boys are healthy. They still have food, I believe. Okay. Hey, stop eating this bread. This is mine. And we are going to Nikada first. Nikada is in J7. I still have my bedroll ish. What? Uh, do you need me to place the mapper? Um. Hmm. No, just pull us there. 
We will I will just show after you pull, you know, you pull me on the map. I will show you where J7 is. So that for those who are watching, uh, they will see it. Okay. Let this be the mark of raid bosses. So we're hunting raid bosses to get their relics. We need to get their relics to open the final dungeon, aka Forsaken Mountain. This will be the start. Let's see how many dungeons we can finish. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Before oh, we go shit. before we go hungry. I, <laughs> I no. forgot to bring my boys. <laughs> yeah. Or do I really have to bring them? I will just not bring them. Um for this, uh I can yeah. Just my two boys are okay. Yeah, okay. We will bring them again, maybe Scargath. Mm. And Eliza. Mm. But for Nikada and Aluri, I think we're good. Okay, bedroll. Ah, this is... I, lo I love this place. This is where I experience my multiple deaths in one game. And I was so freaking pissed. I didn't understand what AOC that time yet. Oz told me, place this in you know, a mod. I didn't know. I didn't watch any video, just like what I always do. I don't spoil myself. So, I like to explore. And I came here without knowing that there is a raid boss here. And this camp, when I joined the world of AOC two years ago, this camp was aggro on site. I said, aggro on site. You see that person on top of the hill? You s that person sees you automatically, the whole camp sees you. And including Nikada. So, yeah. It's Nikada. Yeah, this is where Nikada is. We're going to get the first um, relic from Nikada. Again, subjectively, some people would think Nikada is easier. Some people would think Aluri is easier. But Nikada is basically just there. Um, Aluri's Gore Claw Deep, it has a lot of, you know, twists and turns. And you need to fight a lot of T7s. You need to fight Ashira before getting to her. And once you get to her, she's a... And I don't want to say this, but she's a bitch. Her damage is staggering. She has bleed and she has poison. She can basically one combo a player. So you need to make sure that you have a good tank. Or if you are tanking for yourself, you have a very good plan against her. That's what you need to do. But Nikada, Nikada is basically just straightforward. He's not the same as Gathen that can one shot you. So you should be good. All right, let's kill this guy. Hey, headshot. No what? He's so freaking tanky. <laughs> All right. Let's believe this guy. Oh no, it wouldn't reach. Oh shit, it's, it reached. Make an ice bridge. <laughs> Let's kill this guy. Yeah, ice bridge will be handy here. Oh, let me see if I can climb here. Can I do double jump here? Does it reach? Double jump? It I th doesn't. Think. But yeah, I hate this guy. Why don't you just come down, sir? Hold on. I promise. Nope. I will shoot him till death. Okay. Come on. Shoot me. Shoot me. Let's have a shooting game, sir. Actually, you don't really need to kill this guy. You can just go there and annihilate the whole camp. It's just we want it clean. Let's kill everyone. Oh, he's dying. Come on, T5. Show me what you got. Oh my god, we're bullying a T5. There. I think it's gonna die. There we go. He did. <laughs> okay, so this place has a scout. The scout sees you, everyone aggros. And the scout is... If I'm not mistaken, a dog. I'm I'm gonna be very careful because remember the the patch notes Oz S Pen has another. That's that's the hound. That's the scout. That thing sees you. They will aggro all of them. I think we can handle all of them. I will make my boys attack the hound. 
Is Tesla! No! Why are you here? Okay. <laughs> All right. Freaking hard headed. Tesla's really cute. Yeah, I know. He wants to fight, he said. Oh my god, all of them, man. Yeah, all case. of them. Run! <laughs> run! Run, bitch! Run! Run for now, run for now. Let's be smart. Let's fight them here if they will, they will, you know. If they will follow. Um, I hear Nikada. No, it's not. Oh. Let's kill them. Uh, the boys are coming back. That's not Nikada, right? It's just a grunt. Okay. Whoa! The smelter is smelting me! Nikada's here! I see his bald head with a top knot. Um, our boys are significantly damaged. I don't know why. There was like a lot of them earlier. There was a lot of them? And they're like frenzy all the time. Go, Nikada. All right. No, uh, remember. Don't be unfair. Remember, there is a what you call this? Um, there's a T9 in there. Remember the the quest NPC? That mm -hmm. that person hurts. Hey, stop shooting me. Okay, Nikada is the only one here. Let's be fair with Nikada. The damage is decent. Look, 200 plus. Can you make him bleed? I don't like him. No, I will just poison him. I don't think he can. Oh no, he doesn't. <laughs> what the hell? Remember, he he's he is the brother of Nick uh, of uh, Gathan. If Gathan cannot be poisoned, he cannot be poisoned. And they don't bleed as well, if I'm not mistaken. That's but why. How we about the that's arcane? why. That's why we decided to use. Uh, the oh, the arcane seems to have damage over time. Yeah. That's why we decided to use Black Hole against his brother. Oh, yeah. that's just Nikada, huh? Look at the damage. Okay. Well, I think we will have to make ourselves ready that they will <laughs> definitely die. Okay, is this Nikada? Hold on. Um, do you have harvesting tool? I think you need to carve the the relic from him. Uh, oh, what steel. kind of harvest? Ah, it doesn't matter though. if it's a cleaver or a pick. Everything. Because I there. don't have any. Mm. <laughs> I'll just spawn one if you like. Yeah, go, 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 go. So, what? Cleaver? Uh. Yeah, I want to take his head. No kidding. Just cleaver, yeah. Uh, I'll give you. What? Um. Just this. I don't care. Here, I'm dropping it. Take it. <laughs> Alright, there we go. Nikada is quite easy if you are in the right level. We're actually over the level. You can start yeah. you can start picking on Nikada maybe yeah, maybe after level eighty or level eighty. At least your magic is already ascended third time. Should be cool. Yeah, your brother is gonna be pissed, Nikada! Yeah, we got the Fury Relic. Oh, they are still angry. That's the reason why we got out. We didn't stay. Why did you come back there? I thought they were not angry anymore. What the heck? My boys are healing. Do not <laughs> touch them. Do not make them fight anymore. Let's try fire magic against this guy. Oh, fire magic hurts you, huh? There you go. You really have to keep switching your your weapons to know which one hurts them more. For some reason, it's not always consistent. Some of them would be hurt more fire damage. Some of them are hurt more with arcane. Um, undead is basically hurt with divine magic by default. So yeah, Aaron experimentation. Steelbar. All right. That's yeah. Nikada. That's the first relic. Now we go to Gorklaw Deep to fight Aluri. Now, let's do this legit. Um, let's right. really go to the Gorklaw Deep. So we will use the right way according to us. So we need to TP 
Um, if you Where? are from the Noob River, um, hear us. If you can see my, if you can see my stream here. This is this is where we need to be. In G three, and then here in this enclosed area right here. The moment Pretty you TP in there, area. there will be imps. Yeah, just TP there and then bring me, pull me. I will get my bed. And I forgot about my bed. Damn it! Oh, where's your bed? I can get it. It's there. Where the dare there? Uh, you're going the right way. Where the tablet is? Uh, it's gone. Huh? Yeah, it's gone. Ah, just never mind. That's a <laughs> that's a that's a stick and sticks and leaves. God I know. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> why, why are we wasting our time with? It? Shut up! <laughs> Come. What? Oh, I'm pulling you. <laughs> yeah, fool me. So Do we're you using have Tesla already? Acor oh, okay. according to us, we're using the right way. So yeah, we're we're doing this. Okay, I'll, I'll, the I'll right? Leave, what the hell? <laughs> I'll leave Tesla. Actually, yeah, you're not right. You're not wrong. This is actually the safe way as well. If you don't want to go, um, F one, F one, F three. I mean, <laughs> okay. Uh, did you kill the imps? I'm supposed yeah, to be here. Yeah, I did. Okay, shit. They were bugging me. I will use... Uh, let's see. I will use fire magic against these guys. Oh, shit. Earth, maybe? Some earth magic? Nah. I'll, rem I'll, I'll remain... Um, faithful to the blood magic. Okay. Um, let's go. So, she TP'd me here. So, basically, if you are from... So, our house is here. So if you're from the Noob River, go to G3. There we go, G123. And then come here. This is your starting point. Now facing the mountains, you will see two openings. There's a uh, there and there. That's a no-no. That's not the path. The path is here. All right, and I will show you. Let's pump up our gamma because this place is uh, naturally bright. <laughs> So we'll make it brighter. Shinara Aluri is going down. Or us. I still cannot always guarantee that she's not gonna wreck my boys. Um, especially if she is tanky. If she is tanky and she will not die right away. She can stack a lot of bleed and poison to me and the boys that we will actually die. So yeah. But of course, if you're playing the game with Iwa and Vam, there are some armors and passives already that you can do one-on-one -on -one with her. For now, we're just using everything AOC. Here we go. This is the Goreclaw Deep. Because if you will use that route, you may have to deal with two devil bear cubs okay uh we're not gonna get anything from alexandra but we will try our best to make this a fast run because again we're over level to actually do gore claw i should really go first because of your boys damn it why why are you hating my boys no, I'm not hating them. They're just pushing me away. Uh, make sure you equip your air magic. <laughs> or put it in the hot bar, I mean. Yeah, it's already in the hot bar. See? They're body blocking them. Look. <laughs> is this where the white tiger is? Yeah. White tiger and um, Shinara Aluri. The ninja. The ninja ja. Favorite NPC of us. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> yeah, you can probably make another one, Oz. I want to play that one uh, once again. Just make sure it's okay. fair. Not someone who's 
Can you imagine Shinara Aluri with a spear? Spear is already OP. It it has like a very huge hitbox. It has a very long reach. And you put that with Shinara Aluri? God damn. We are in Konoha, yes. We are in Konoha. Oh shit, I forgot about this guy. Oh shit, shit, shit. I'm in a boo-boo. I'm in a boo-boo. I'm in a Oh, shit, 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 shit. Uh, tiger, 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 tiger. <laughs> oh, sheesh. Oh, sheesh. Oh, 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 it gives a key, I think. Hold on. It a gives key. a key and a head, I think. Hold on. Oh, they're fighting already. What the hell? Hold on. We should not ignore, uh, you know. It gives a key. It doesn't give the head. Now, the head will be very useful if you are doing Iwa. Oz is busy. But it seems like there's no head for me. Alright. Okay. See, I told you the boys are okay here. Um, I think they will give Crescent water. If I'm not mistaken. What I'm not collecting me? them yet. Cause... I just want to know what they give. Cobalt? Apple! An apple a day? The choo choo keeps, doctor away. Keeps the doctor away. Uh, it's just food. It doesn't give any buff. Okay. Da 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 da. Shut up, sister. To make Goreclaw Deep more challenging, I think you can start with level 30 here. And um, you have better Thrall, like bring two Thralls. Level 30, and then no Karazard par Paragon leveling, and then there are two of you. But if there are already, let's say if there are already like four, five, or six of you, I think it will be fun if you will not bring anything. <laughs> Neeps gaming style. That's why I really love them. Mystical potion. Oh, tomato. A tomato. Potato. Ah, potato. they give crescent water us. It's not only the silver coven. Yeah, yeah. It's also them. So, is it safe to say that Elvin? The Elvin gives mm. crescent water? Yep, four yep, or five? Yep. Yeah. If you're four or five... Do not bring anything in here and it will be fun. Trust me. It will be it will be boring if you will bring thralls, especially if there are two thralls each. Maybe one thrall each. It's still uh, fun. Okay. Uh the tiger already aggroed. Yeah, I forgot it's about this coming. place. It's supposed to be here. There're like two of them. No, it's supposed to be this line, not this line. What happened there? They already aggroed. I don't that's, know. That's too far. That's too far. Well, that's okay. Yeah, they hate my damage. AC can be a thrall. Mama Do! Mama Do 53, hello! How are you doing? AC can be the thrall. Well, you don't have to, knowing AC's personality in gaming, you don't even have to tell him that he needs to be the thrall. He will thrall for you without being told. Okay, I need to. I need to fight fairly against these guys. Come come in here. No, I, I wanna one-on-one -on -one this guy. Yeah, so that they will one-on-one. -on -one. Okay, here. Ah, the projectile, you mean. Yeah. Because um, they play unfair. <laughs> if I wanna do melee, I really need to bank on my stamina more. I'm dealing a lot of damage. Look. See that? That's 300, 359. That's really huge. And... I do cripple and bleed. Heavy attacks from one-handed axe can deal bleed. 
and triple. Where's it water again? He always gets lost. Yeah, he's the Zoro of the team. AC, and then you will just know he died. You will just say, oh, I died. Oh, they aggro so fast. Just stay in the ward. Oh, it's okay. Oh, I should have brought my dagger. My, you know, um, Sanguis dagger. God, look at the damage of my boys. It's so freaking staggering. Boom. Holy sheesh. Whoa, 500, 600? God damn. I wish my damage is like that. They also give Crescent Steel. I'm just gonna get the food. Archers with Peck Peck shorts. I know, right? Gotta love it. Oh shit, I missed! Okay, let's have some fire magic against these people. 308, 312. Okay. That's a lot of damage still. 308, 312. And Kamehame wave! Whoa! Okay, got it. <laughs> Yeah, they're quite easy now. They're not supposed to be fought in this level. But since we're just showing a walkthrough, this is uh, this is what we have as of the moment. Once we already play uh, like an actual playthrough, you will see us... Uh, me, I want to play it safe all the time. You probably will see us do this... Level 60-ish. Like after vanilla. Hey, what did you use? Uh, the attack for my earth magic. When you slam, they bounce. Yeah. Oh damn! Like the like the bear? I uh, like the elephant. <laughs> Whoa! Be careful of that because Shit. we have the same magic. Yeah, it hurts. What the heck? I have a very thick armor, and that thing. Whoa! I got poisoned was able to hurt me. God damn it. Earth magic hurts. Yeah, poison and shit. I got and three cripple. stacks. Don't forget the okay. cripple. Shinara time. Ah! Potato! Potato and Crescent Steel Bar. Yeah. Potato. Alright. I hope Espen is still in the chat because... The last time, the last time we did this, um, Ashira was so weak, Espen. Ashira didn't seem like a raid boss anymore. So, intentional, maybe, but I want you to see it. Oh, I did. So, we will try to make these two guys fight Ashira alone. Um, we will kill the cats as much as possible. And that's n supposedly... Supposedly, Ashira should be stronger than, you know, just faction pets. But for some reason, it was very easy last time. All magic should be fairly powerful in its own right. Less focus on any magic being starter or endgame. And more focus on preferences. Correct. That's true. That is true. It's all about your preference. The type. For example, just like the the talk about sta having a staff earlier and just, you know, regular weapons. The last time I checked about staves, the damage was not actually that that much. Unless maybe Espen can confirm. Espen, did you do any buffs on staves since last July? Kira. Because I tested staves last July and the difference is not really that much. 
the only advantage that I think staves have is because you can put different magic in them but if you do ultimate it's still gonna respect the original element which is kind of you know i don't remember what i did yesterday so no clue there we go <laughs> we will test it no problem okay so ashira is there i will check ashira's hp um we will we will make the focus on the regular cats first. Ashira. Okay, I got Ashira's aggro. I will just run around. I will run around until my boys can kill. Careful, us. Until my yes. boys can kill the, the Gore Claw. I will just run around. I know her pattern. Yeah, I, I want Ashira to do 2v1 with my boys. Okay, one Gore Claw is almost dead. Let's make sure that they don't. Okay, another Gore Claw. Ashira only has 16k. And my boys have 13. But knowing Ashira before, like the real Ashira Ashira, there should be a lot of damage. Okay, let's leave them alone. If it's still the same. Do not do any heals or cast anything. He's a little tanky now. The last the last time that we did this test, we let Ashira fight two Scourge Hounds, not Faction Pets. And Ashira almost killed one, but the other one was still full uh, full health. And yeah, it also took a while. A little tanky, if you ask me. But the damage of Ashira is not the same as the Ashira in the Unnamed City. I don't know if you can still remember the Ashira in the Unnamed City, Oz. But that Ashira was... scary. However... I'm not sure if this is intentional, but this could be intentional knowing that Ashira is just now a um, a sub, not a sub. Sorry, Ashira now is just a a mini boss to Aluri. You know, I'll make note of it. Okay, see us. I told you, this is not intentional because Aspen would not take note of this if this is intentional. Ashira really became weak. And the bad thing is, no one has reported this or talked about this in Discord, I think. They're just... They just like taking advantage of, you know, the game becoming easy now. And that's not supposed to be the, the case. You should really report irregularities like this. For example, me. Me and us, we realize that Divine Magic is hurting everyone and... It doesn't really matter anymore. I will just use Divine Magic because it's pretty much painful to undead and living. So I have to tell Espen because, you know, even though the balance in this game is far-fetched, it's a stretch, but at least we're helping somehow to give balance to the game. What are you doing in there? Nothing. I'm just checking out the place because it looks like a nest or something. Yeah, this is where they were lying down, I think. Oh, no, they were lying down outside. Oh, by the way, I forgot. You need to, you need to uh, loot the ethereal power. So that you can unlock the did gate. You? Yeah, I did. Did you? Yeah. Okay. Oh! Hmm? What? Uh, we need to show the book somehow. Ascension 4, Arcane. I do? Is it not Ashira? Uh, uh, wait, hold on. Is it not Ashira? I think it's Ashira. Wait. Yeah, because did, did we you get it. Remember, we we start we tried killing Malagan three times, yeah, and Malagan three does times. not give the the book anymore, so it the should book. be Ashira. Yeah, uh. but there's none. I think Espen and the team they're already starting to change um, yep, the acquisition the acquisition already. of Ascension. 
But yeah, that was before. But for now, if ever you don't get it from Ashira, just buy it from the Quest NPC, please. Do not buy it from the Arcane Hall uh, merchant. She is a ripoff. She has well, like... Unless, unless they're, they're rich. Why not, right? Oh yeah, if you have a lot of money. <laughs> uh, especially if you played a lot of hours already. You should have a lot of money. Yeah, or no Ascension books. Sponsor. Okay, there we go. See? No more Ascension books. There we go. So yeah, they're already working on... Um, getting the ascension books through quest lines Woo, i'm excited for that i want to do that i want to do it yeah. and we are definitely going to make another playthrough i know Yay. look how much fun we had looking for that thing you know earlier yeah well, well to be honest we had espen helping us <laughs> Oh, no. Fire magic is more painful against these guys. So I will use fire. Sometimes dump, dump, water magic is dump, also dump, more dump. painful than... Ah, the Azahirians! I used to use... I used to use water magic against the Azahirian. Whoa! You look so powerful every time you do that, us. But I don't know. For some reason, I get blood on my screen every time you do it. Can you do it again? Oh, it's not. It's not you. I think it's someone shooting me or hitting me. I will toss you. <laughs> I really do agree with Espen. It's no longer about low level, low level magic or um, end game magic. It's all about. How you're gonna? Yeah, it's your preference and how you want to do, uh, how you want to play your magic. Because see, I'm just using fire and I'm already wrecking their faces. I may as well start using earth later on or air because I haven't, I have been so unfair to air magic. I will be honest with that. But yeah. Uh, hmm? what? You're getting near. Oh, okay, shit. I thought. Don't scare me like that. Don't scare me like that. Um, I'm not sure if Shinara gets burned. Probably I need to... I, I just need to probably... Uh, whatchamacallit? Bleed her? I will use divine... Not divine, sorry. Blood magic against her. Or maybe I can do melee with her. Because... Well, she's considered to be like... Not that powerful of a raid boss. But again, depending on your level and whatever gear you have. So, you're you're seeing this like we're having an easy time right here. But if ever you come here with a low level or at least like not prepared in terms of gear and food. Yeah, this is going to be really difficult. Have to go to bed. Good night, Ash. Thank you so much, Ash, as always. I'll see you later, Ash. Mom has an appointment later. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. All right. Okay, cool. All right, we're almost there where Shinara is. Now remember, these these um, mobs here, the calibers are all T7. So they don't joke around with damage. So to give you to give you a uh, a benchmark on the perspective of what's happening here, I am already wearing the best armor in AOC. I am already wielding level five um, with all the magic. And look at the damage that they actually dish out. So if I don't have a proper, um, say, tank, if I don't have these boys to tank, even with my level and us, there's still the danger of actually getting killed. Now, Aluri might aggress or not from here, but I hope she doesn't. Sometimes she comes, you know, she comes down. I think she is guarded by two Gorklaws, if I'm not yep. mistaken. Oh, 
Okay, cool. All right. Okay. Um, we will assist. I will have my boys attack and tank. We will fight here, us. Come here. Where? Here. We're good. Okay. Um, killing the Gorkla. And we're... Okay, I can't see anything. This is dangerous. Let me just... They're both dead now. It's just Renara. Alright, good. Hold on us. Who oh, shit! <laughs> okay, we have to help them. You see the damage that she has? She's poison and bleed. Careful us. You have cleanse, right? Just in case. I will make her cripple. Then hold on. I will I will try to be fair to her at least. But if I if I don't help, this hound is gonna die. Look. Yeah. Okay, let's That's help. why I'm using the cripple and poison. Look how painful this woman is. How about I use arcane? Is it gonna hurt uh, her? Just more? make sure she's Oh shish! How did she find me? Uh yeah, it seems to have hurt her a lot. Keep doing it. Um, you have hosabs, right? So you see, you should see the damage popping out. What's your damage with arcane? Hold on. There you go. Observe. Four hundred twenty-one. Four hundred? Holy shit! Okay, then arcane against her. And dot is twenty-five. Take note, chat. Arcane is more painful to Shinara. I, we should have tested it with the uh, rangers also earlier. It should. Arcane is more expensive to learn in terms of money. So 56k, she is half the HP of Gathen. So as you can see, if, if, ever, if ever you are fighting her without the boys, like you are, as I mentioned earlier, four or five of you playing without the, without the pets, without the thralls, it will be more fun. You will die though. You will die a lot. But I don't think Oz should be in that playthrough because she gets angry when she dies. She's not making Yeah, I will comment. not play. <laughs> there we go. All right. We have the next. Hey, where's the relic earlier? Hold there. On. Oh, it's here. I fed it to Raijin. It's in his stomach. All right, so that's Shinara Aluri. Uh, let's see if Espen made an exit already in this place. I'm trying to heal. Hold on, I'm still healing up Azul's and you're already walking okay, away. Okay, 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 okay. Hey, chill. Why are you angry? What the hell? Why are you so mad? Because you kept <laughs> on telling me that I get angry easily. <laughs> well, especially if you die because of my recklessness, you get angry easily. Tell me if I'm wrong. Who wouldn't? Who wouldn't? <laughs> there you go, chat. That's my life. I am the beta male. <laughs> um, let's see if there's any exit. Aspen, I think I think putting a deep connection here will be great. Yeah. Or do you want us to really just walk back or run back? to the exit but of the dungeon there's already a tornado man it, oh yes there is a tornado okay let's go tornado so we should just jump there huh all right could we like jump there yeah there here i will okay. jump here using my cleaver I got some plans ah. for Gore Claw. Oh, yes! There we go, Oz. Question asked. Question answered. 
Love it. Uh oh, I think I think I'm bugged. Because I still have the slow fall even though I'm not equipped. Hold on. Okay, there we go, it disappeared. <laughs> Where's the bridge? Ah, let's go there. It should be going that way. This way? Yeah. Come, come. You can just cross the water. I think so. Hey! The answer is yes. Oh shit! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I fell short! <laughs> yeah, let's let's spare those guys. There we go, baby. Right. Oh the boopsies! The boopsies! Like perfect accent for the boopsies. And we are back in the arcane hall. Hey, you're stepping on my head. All right, so we have Enough. already. I'm gonna go back to the dude. Since we're already here anyway, I'm gonna go back to the dude. Where's the dude? Where's Ferengar? I call him the Ferengar uh, Senior because he will be the last Ferengar giving you missions. Do it, do so it, Storm it, Relic, it. Uh, not yet. Midnight though, yes. There we go. Owner Tokens, 25. Fury Relic, Owner Token, another 25. So we have four more. Four more raid bosses to kill. And those bosses will give us four more um relics that we can use to unlock the door to the forsaken mountain so um next one will be well i'm torn mama bear or eliza cole actually they're almost same same um a lot of people would probably say no because eliza cole seems to be easier or some people would think mama bear seems to be easier it really depends on how you're gonna play it because in the in the cold embrace camp uh mama bear will be next yeah we can probably go mama bear next because in the cold embrace camp the only reason why you would probably get wrecked is because you pulled the wrong crowd or you aggroed the boss first or you aggro the scout aggro the boss aggro the scout it aggros everyone in the camp um, I don't know. Countless times that we have raided Eliza Cole, there was no problem. Eliza Cole will always be um, the last one that we will kill. So we uh, we kill pretty much everyone around the camp and then we go to Eliza Cole. We do the same thing with Mama Bear. However, Mama Bear seems to already aggro sometimes even though we're attacking still um, in the lower, you know, in the lower level. So... We were expecting that Mama Bear would aggro when we climb up there and fight the the actual uh, the actual mini bosses. We call them Devil Bears. The cubs are also at the lower level. Some cubs and there are also some Devil Bears. So sometimes Mama Bear gets aggro when we are still fighting um, in the lower level, and that's when it becomes difficult. Not because of how fast they are, because they're not really that fast. They're so tanky, and if you don't have a good armor, and if you don't get, if you don't have a good healing, most of the time your boys are gonna die. And if we don't also want to bring too much. Like, I don't wanna, I don't want you guys to see me bringing three thralls or four thralls already. That's just, that's just ridiculous. Uh, I would even feel guilty bringing two. However, two seems to be a good number. Um, if ever you are just looking for a tank. Oz needs tanking a lot because um, Oz elders, his her boys, they're so squishy. Level 20, they only have 6,000 in HP. That's less than a half, less than 50% of what my boys have. 
and they're using divine magic so it means when they're casting they're ba basically just standing there so i have to provide uh tankiness however if there will be more more than two more than three maybe bringing one thrall one pet would be more fun or not bringing any thrall or pet at all you know finding a way to finish the game without using thrall would probably be really fun i haven't tried that yet because I was expecting that I will be playing this game with, let's say, for example, the Jongi and the others that, you know, she, he named. But most of the time, um, drama ensues and most of the time they are no longer playing. So, yeah, um, I think it's good that they start with vanilla. I agree with that. You cannot really appreciate the game. Uh, the, the appreciation of the mod is different when you have experienced vanilla. So that you would say like, ah, oh, oh my god, this is vanilla, something like that. You really? This is it for vanilla? Okay, and I would appreciate it more if I have Iwa, if I have AOC, if I have Vam. I will enjoy the content because after that, you probably will need to take a break from Conan for how many months before you would feel like you want to play again. That's usually the case. It's not that you're burnt out, it's basically just... You want to play other games until you, you know, miss Conan again or there are new huge contents from the mods or from the base game and then you come back playing. All right. Hold on. Um, Let me see. Okay. I think it's a good stopping point because I'm hungry. Are you hungry, Lass? Yeah. I am very hungry. And we need to kill four more raid bosses on the next stream. We will kill four more raid bosses. We get the relics. We finish the Forsaken Mountain. After we finish the Forsaken Mountain, tan, 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 we can already craft the last magic ascension. And that is called the soul magic. All right. So we will test the soul magic damage using the actual weapon and using the staff. Um, Iceman mentioned earlier that the staff from Harbinger seems to cause more damage than the uh, than just merely having the weapon. So we will test that later on. Um, we have to keep testing so that <clears throat> we can also uh, see if you know S Pen needs to do some tweaking or needs to do some adjustment. At least we're showing the damage, just like we what we did with Divine Magic and the other magic in our last stream. And that at least, you know, will give him an idea on how to balance it. That's what we're doing. This is not yet the playthrough. We're just showing um, steps on how to acquire stuff. We have accomplished a lot today. We have seen a lot today. Especially the highlights of the patches for the last, um, for the last update for AOC. I bet... Um, Espen will have in the following weeks or probably in a month will have fixes and additions we are so excited for that we're gonna showcase those again and we will keep playing work uh, walkthroughs until the game is already in a good place the moment that I get a good feedback from Espen that they have already placed what they want to place and the mod is in a good place for a playthrough then that's the time we're going to do a playthrough you are leg broken madam i don't know what's wrong with you your I leg is facing backwards it's like a goat like can you see it even on your end how about me is my leg crooked i don't know <laughs> all right so for those who haven't uh seen our playthroughs yet uh, we will do another one and for this walkthrough i will be putting um timestamps in the description below so if you haven't followed, like, or subscribe yet, please do so if you want to. That would really help not only me, but also for those who are looking for... Is it better now? Yeah, it's better now. Especially for those who are looking for temporary guides as well. And that being said, thank you so much, you guys, for, for, for those who are still here. For those who subscribed and followed me on Twitch, thank you very much. Uh, it seems that we are staying in Twitch uh, for, uh, you know, for now because um, I haven't seen a lot of transfers in um, Kick yet, so we will stay in Twitch. I respect that. That's okay. We can always also um, check the replays in YouTube. So click that notification bell if ever you want to see when I go live. And then, Espen. 
thank you so much for being here. Every, every walkthroughs nowadays, um, Espen has always been there, um, taking our feedback, listening to our feedback, listening to our arguments. Um, and I really like it, especially when, um, it remains professional and non-biased. At least Espen will at least know because he's the lead developer of AOC. And at least, you know, he knows people's opinion. And it will be his choice. It will be his, his last call on how he wants us to experience the game. So if ever he makes some changes, let's respect that. Because if Espen knows it's bad, trust me, he knows it's bad. And he will do something about it. But if we know you're just, you know, against it because you want to make it easier and you want to cut corners, in my personal opinion, I don't think this is the mod for you. If you like cutting corners, I don't think this is a mod for you. Go Iwa, enjoy Iwa. It's more powerful than AOC. Just use Iwa, you know, uh, armor and weapons. And, you know, just enjoy how easy the game can go. All right. But in terms of skipping content, just because, especially for, again, I'll make this very clear, especially for the new ones, we need to give them a good experience on how progression feels in this game from vanilla to aoc to iwa to vam that's supposed to be the right progression and if we cannot you know help this game bounce back because people you know will just quit playing or play for how many days because eh, i can buy a t9 at level one where my friend gave me a t9 holy crap there we go you will go around the map you're still level one and everything will be wrecked by a t9 would you really want that again that's basically preference and i totally respect if that's your preference but i don't think that's what our modders would want us to do we want to enjoy the content that they work so hard to you know to put in place and i still want to pay that respect i want to respect also for the base game for funcom i'm okay with the orb working level one to level four of you know a t1 to t4 that's okay because those are really like if you will use those against AOC, those tiers will just get wrecked. But it will be a different, you know, if it will be a different story already when you just don't work hard to get good pets and good thralls. I think that's a totally different story. It's all about preference, but then again, there should always be the right. Thank you so much. I enjoy the changes, um, Espen. And I'm I'm really grateful that you're also considering our feedback. Oz has been very grateful with the changes. She was actually like so ecstatic when she found those things for me. And I think there will still be more to be found. Um, and I'll see you on the next one. It could be tomorrow. Um, Oz seems to have a business with Nightingale Alpha. Um, so I don't know if she's gonna do it. But if she's gonna do it, we will continue with the dungeons and the raid bosses. I'll see you guys on the next one. And as always, stay safe. Peace out. That will be all for now. I'll see you on the next episode for more walkthroughs. Bye-bye for now, you guys. Thank you for the support. Bye, yo. Bye, yo. the tables i could do this just keep moving keep your hands up stupid i feel lucid a new viewing i can see the end i can see my future i can view it it's right there for the taking everything i've ever wanted dreams are just waiting i just gotta fight for it willing to die for it willing to like soreness i just need a hike for it I'm standing up cause I've had enough I won't give up on my chance As long as I'm breathing, I'm not retreating I could be bleeding, I'll take a beating And keep on proceeding, I'm not fatiguing Cause once I get to the ring, I'll be undefeated Feet. 
I got everything I need to be the greatest I could be. Watch out, I'm here now. Big mood, no doubts. Big moves, big mouth. Hit hard, knockout. I come from a different pedigree. Destiny told me anything. I make everything in my life come to life. Manifest.